All right. Rain World. Game where you play as a slug cat. And um, it's a, I guess, a survival game. Uh, I don't know. The resolution for the game is very weird because the options that they have for the resolutions are there's like no 1920 by 1080 which I don't even think exists let me see where's the 1920 by 1080p mode I'm just probably gonna stick to the one that it started with should be fine using third 1366 by 768, which is 16 by 92. Uh, let's see. After like. Requiring reworking of all pixel art assets in the game. Jesus. Okay, then. Interesting. Well, there you go. That's why. <laughs> so, um, yeah, anyways. So, apparently, from all I've heard is that the, ga the game's controls are scary, I think. I've heard someone... There was a review that said... Um, let me see here. <clears throat> there was a review talking about the controls, and then I asked, I asked in a Discord server... Uh, and, uh, let's see, uh, uh, did they mention, here we go. Problems with movement can be solved with mods to the point where it becomes tight and well polished but natural feel. What does that mean? Are the controls not good? What? Like, what does that mean? Rain. Rain World controls? Uh, I'm just gonna play with the controller. I, I don't think this game involves like a lot of control schemes. I, you know, it's not like Dwarf Fortress. But I guess we'll just go ahead and start it. But there is a DLC um, coming out. For too long here. It is uh <clears throat> it's uh I, I guess it's coming out next month or uh something like that. And it adds a bunch of content to the game. I don't know what. I've never played it, so I can't really say if it's worth it or not. Yeah, here's the here's the resolution. This is the one it chose as the option which is 16 by 40 the rest of these are whatever and if i go to controls i'd have to go all the, over here and then do this and here's the controls um which if you i guess you can change your controls but this is what it looks like so i'm gonna I guess make my control scheme. So pause is gonna be that. Okay. What's going on? I can't do anything. What? Map is button five. Oh, I can't use the D-pad for some reason. That's weird. Pick up and eat, uh, which I guess will make X. And then jump is button zero. And throw is apparently button one. 
which is... Uh, I guess I'll make that... I, I can't make that my bumpers, so I guess I'll make it that. Or, I make it button one, which is what it had before. Which I'm okay with, I guess. Okay. And this one has the exact same thing. Um, because you use the joystick for these. So they don't need to be remapped. Or I guess the D-pad. Uh. Yeah. So, this game doesn't have, like, complicated controls. Or at least the buttons. I don't know about actually controlling the character. In the movement factor, but we'll give it a try. So we have the monk. Uh, we have the survivor. We have the hunter. Which, I don't have the hunter. So for some reason it started with the monk. Weak, weak of body, but strong of spirit. In tune with the mysteries of the world and empathetic to its creatures, your journey will be a significantly more peaceful one. Oh, easy mode. Okay. <laughs> Survivor. A nimble omnivore, both predator and prey, lost in a harsh and indifferent land. You must make your own way and wit, uh, with wit and caution as your uh, greatest asset. I don't think I have either, so we'll see. I'm going to use rock, I guess. I like rock. There better be, uh, if this has any, like, speaking, hopefully it doesn't. I guess it doesn't. I don't know why it would. Oh my god, it's one shot. It's the sun orb. That, it's the light bulb. That game was depressing. I played one shot, and I even designed it so I could do it the second time to get the true ending. And, um... I never did. I think the true ending is you get... If you played us in the entire time the second time, you, uh... I think, um... You get both the, both the endings instead of having to choose one or the other. It's really depressing. I don't like to think about the choice that I made. No, I don't... What's going on? I fell in a vat of acid. Rest in peace, Rick and Morty, by the way. Never seeing another season from that again, most likely. Unless it get, gets compro uh, like proven false despite the charges being there. I don't know. <laughs> it's like... What's going on with that? I don't... I don't know, dude. Okay, so we're in. How do I play? Come on, game. Show me the controls. If I sit here long enough, will the game tell me? Oh my god, why is he shaking like that? You okay, buddy? Alright, here. I'll just... I'll just play. you can get down on the ground. So you can jump. Okay. I love the little slime character. I, 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 I'm I sorry, but I love pixel art in general. Game design is so fr freaking cool. Whoa. Can I climb that? No. Okay. Okay, so you can toggle it. I can't use the D-pad, by the way. I have to use the joystick. That's how they designed it. Okay. You are hungry. Find food? I just started. How do I get that? Are you food? Hello? What are you? Hello? 
Huh? Friend? Okay. The fuck. You are food, right? Get over here. I want to eat you. Come here. Whoa. Okay, so I need to watch out for these spikes, like, by not jumping into them. Get over here. Num num num. This game reminds me exactly like, um... Four is enough to hibernate. Okay. Get over here. Let me eat you. Come here. <laughs> Got you! I'm gonna eat you, fucker. Additional food above is, is, four is kept for later. Okay. Hey, can you talk to me? Wait. Oh, shit. Okay. Yeah, there's this one game. I forgot the name of it. It's, um, where you play as, like, a... It's, like, Vexel design, and it's a... It's a, um... It's a rhythm game for the PlayStation 1. I want to eat you. I want to... I want to eat you. I want to fucking eat you. I just forgot the name of it. Is this way? Little hole? Okay. Oh! Are you okay? So if I... Okay, so I can... I can hit A when I'm not doing anything to drop down. Okay. And they're delicious. Little square. Whoa. You're full. Okay. So that's the, just the little tutorial character thing. What the hell? Okay, so we need to go up here. Want me to go up here? Okay. Okay. Leap the ga uh, leap the gap. <laughs> okay. Wait, what? Fuck. Rain is coming. Find shelter? What? This place is safe. Stay in here to hibernate. Uh, huh? Huh? <laughs> Whoa. What? <laughs> Continue? What? <laughs> Whoa. What's going on? Okay. So there's rain now. Go explore. There is food and shelter to be found, but beware of predators. Okay. Thanks for that. Okay. Objects can be picked up and carried and tossed. Whoa. 
I have a gun. Is that a gun? I want the gun. So you can only throw... Okay, you can only throw forward. You can't throw up or down. Okay. What was that? Whoa. Huh. I think I would assume we'd want to go up. There's food up there. <laughs> okay, I have an idea. Food. No. Oh. Okay. <laughs> okay. That didn't work. <laughs> I want that. I want that food. I guess I could just... No. I need to do the thing that I was... <gasps> Bat! Bat! Okay. No! <laughs> Come back. Fuck. Yes. <laughs> I'm getting after you, motherfucker. I'm killing you. Where you at? Where'd it go? Ah, there you are. Get over here. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Come here. I want you. Come here. Oh no, I missed. <laughs> I'm gonna go this way. Oh, he's coming! <laughs> uh. Get get in here. He's looking for me. Come over here, motherfucker. See what happens. Wake up and see who finds out. Dick. I hit him. That must have scared him away. Come here. Ah, oh, fuck. I need to use the rock to hit him. Fuck. Okay. Got an idea. Come on. Come here. Come here. Come on. Come here. I'm waiting. Hold on, game. I need to eat. I need to fucking eat. I need to eat. I need to eat. I have an idea. Crawl up here. Yes! My character was smart. I didn't have to fucking babysit them. They just did it themselves! Yes! Eat them. Yes! You're fucked now. Come here. Oh, damn. You're like diving into like the... <laughs> into the things. I just need to like swing it at him. I need to throw it at him. Okay, come on. Alright, alright, alright. Ah! Yes! Okay, it went all the way over there. I just have to... I have to go get it. Which I think I can do from just going over here. So basically, you want to... You want to hold up, and then slide in there. Okay. 
and then cr crawl up here. Okay. Get out of here. What are you? Here's a strange uh, here's a strange energy. Hmm. Can I I can go up. What is that? Wait. No freaking way. What's up here? A place I can hibernate? Do I want to? I don't think I want to yet, but here's a place I can go. I seriously don't know what to do with this. What do you do with this? Wait, what? Huh? What did I do? Why did they want me to go up here? Hold on. <sighs> Why do you want me to come in here? Wait, what? What's going on? Wait, why am I doing this? Okay, I guess I'm hibernating. Okay. <laughs> I guess I'm, I'm hibernating now. So it uses up to four. Oof. So you really do need to eat and hunt for food. Okay. Okay, so it did in fact rain. Cycle two outskirts. What does that mean? Food. Yeah, we should probably go get food, shouldn't we? Thanks for that. Which way do you, did you see food? Whoa, you can roll? What the heck was that? That was awesome. Hold on. Do it again. Ah. Uh, okay. Food's this way. Okay. Let's go this way. Wait, what? Crocodile. Oh. Insects? Those little insects there? Can I eat those? Those are. Okay. Can I... Whoa. So I can't stab it. So if I double tap the equip button. Oh shit. Come here, motherfucker. Come here. I dare you. Bitch. <laughs> oh fuck. Wait, hold on. Oh fuck. Grab this. I think it's more scared of me now. Down here? Oh fuck. Where am I? Ha! Huh! Got one! Nom 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 Come here <laughs> Ah! Fuck! Get over here! Come here! Got him Yeah! Alright Thanks. I don't know what to do now, so I guess I'll just hang out. Um, actually, let's see. Which ways have I gone? I have not gone that way, and I haven't gone that way. Okay. What happens if you overeat? Can you overeat in this? No. Okay. Good to know. I could probably use this as, like, a distraction. This way. Well, yeah, I know to go that way. Oh, fuck. Eat it. Ow. Ah! Don't hurt me. They're biting each other. What the hell? 
away from me. Freak. <laughs> oh, go down this way. Can I go down that way? Wait, what? Oh. <laughs> kind of want to go this way. Why do you want me to go that way? Why can't I explore? I'm not doing that. I'm already good on food, but this is good to know. So where are we? So this will just take me back to that way. So this is kind of like a dead end, basically. Ah, I see. Okay. So that was a dead end. Which ways did these go? Do these go anywhere? I don't think it does. I think these are just... I have a feeling that a lot of it is, in fact, random. There's a red thing coming from that way. What is that? What the hell are you? Hey, get back here. Get back here. I'm gonna fucking eat you. Yeah. Now what? I think he wants to kill me? I'm not sure. I've never gone this way. <laughs> Whoa. Where are we? We're in like a big area. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. That's all I'm gonna say the entire time. Yeah, now what? Come here. What are you doing? He's angry. Get out of here, asshole. Whoa! What the hell is that thing? <laughs> those are like, those are like sucker. Whoa. I'm getting the fuck out of here. No, 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 no. Go, 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 go. Those are like, that's like a, that's like, that's like a stabby, that's like a, that's like a weird stabby animal. It likes, oh fuck. <laughs> dude, fuck that. <sighs> fuck that, dude. <sighs> oh. Which way do I need to go? Alright. I can't go this way. <gasps> Dude, this is fucking stupid. What kind of shit is this? Whoa. Yo, actually, thank you. Dude, not bad. It literally helped me out here. Okay. Whoa. If we follow the, the creature, right? If we follow the green things. Yeah, okay. Now's our chance. Now's our chance. We gotta get the fuck out of here. Okay. Get out of here. Whoa, purple? Ooh! Ooh! I don't know if it's a threat to us yet. That's all I know. Can I grab that? I can't. Wait, where am I? Have I been here? Dude. Where am I? This is crazy. This is genuinely, like, really cool. What is this way? 
Oh, it's gonna rain, isn't it? So, is that what that means? It's gonna rain. We need to go. I ex I fucked around and found out, and now I'm gonna pay f pay the price for that. That's why they're all leaving. Oh no! I need to go, quick, dude. I need to go. Fuck off. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Alright. We're safe. We're safe. I fucked around and found out, dude. <laughs> so that looks like it's almost like a dead end. I- I have to, like, do this kind of weird. So if we go that way, that takes us there. And then that takes us- okay. First first of all, we need to get food. That's our first, uh, order. That's our first thing. Outskirts. Food's this way. Okay. Wait. I should have grabbed a, uh, I should grab this just in case. Okay. Alright. Where's food? Me. Are those food? Are these food? I don't know if these are food. I don't think they are. They're just little insects that don't matter. Okay. Let's go through here. Whoa. Okay. Hmm. Oh god. Ah! I'm dead. <laughs> I died. <laughs> what? What happened? Okay. So it's definitely not like a roguelike. That's what I've learned. It is not a roguelike. Uh, as far as I can tell. Where's food? This way. I saw a rainbow. Rainbow. Double rainbow. Ow. I'm gonna assume food's down here. It is not. There's food. Can I? There's food. Okay, it's going this way. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I know home is that way. Thanks. Come here. <laughs> okay. I think there's food this way? No. Okay. We need to figure out because I think... No, there's actually more this way. We haven't gone this way before. We just need to find a way up there, which I think we can just do from here. No, we have to we have to do it from this. <laughs> I'm a slug cat. What the hell? Thanks. Come here. Get over here. Get over here. Come here. You fucker. <laughs> you 
You son of a bitch. Ran away. What is this way? New! New world! The hell are you? I don't think that's anything deadly, so we're good. Whoa. Can I eat this? Wait, what? I guess that doesn't do anything for me. Should probably not eat something that's not initially or obviously beneficial. <laughs> oh. Whoa. There's a thing over here. What's over here? You can tell me. Um, okay, what's down here? The fuck are you? You're like a gross ass roach. Like, I hate you. I hate you. I don't like your design at all. I'm gonna eat this. Okay. Well. Hi. <laughs> Whoa. Don't touch that. That's what I'm learning from that thing. Don't touch that. I think I go this way. So it's down? Is there a... There's nowhere to go from down. So it has... I have to go... This way? Right over here. So this is a place I can go into. Whoa, it can climb. Okay. safe lore little eyeball thing so what is this what happens here the survivor? I'm confused. <laughs> I want a game exactly like this, but with like 50,000 more mechanics. <laughs> I want everything about this game, but with more shit going on. If that makes sense. Okay. I don't exactly trust that pole. I think that's an insect that wants to kill me. <laughs> that's what I'm getting out of that. I, I think that's a vine that wants to kill me. I think that's, that's a thing that wants to murder me. <laughs> Take my... I think anything that's bigger than me that's not... Those things... Uh, get out of here. I just don't want to deal with that right now. Did I kill? I did not kill that. That's what I can tell from that. I did not kill it. That is still alive. Those are alive. They're like stacking. What the hell? I'm actually curious. Are you alive? It's dead. I just dropped it into the water. It's definitely dead. If it wasn't dead before, it's dead now. Okay. 
So I need to... Can I eat this? Can I eat you? I don't think I can eat this. I'm just going to go ahead and swim up here. And I'm going to... Who the fuck are you? Yeah, get out of here, asshole. I did not mean to do that. I'm going to eat this now. Okay. Whoa! Hello. Okay, I cannot go this way. It looks like this thing can barely swim. So, I think we're okay. <laughs> I think this thing's stupid. I think the, these, these crocodile things are really, really dumb. And all they know is to murder and kill. I'm having trouble getting up this. I need to... Um... I'm, I, I need to, uh... <laughs> okay. We're, we're good. We're in, like, a sewer area. There's something that way, but I can't... I don't think I can go that way. So I'm gonna keep going this way. Take the rock. Whoa, hey. What are you? Are you dangerous? I think you're okay. There's more of them. Hi. I don't know what you are. I'm gonna go now. I can't go this way. Is this a dead end? No? I can keep going this way. Whoa. What's going on? Am I going to die? Let me in. Let me in. Please. Please let me in. Okay. Okay. Yep. Yep. Alright. This is like, okay. This is exactly like Limbo. Um, if Limbo was like more, st like, if it had like a lot of style to it like this game. I mean, the game does have style, but what I mean is, it's like, there we go. No. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Alright. I need to get up there. I think I need to do my, my epic jump attack. Okay, that didn't work. I need to not move whenever I do it. Okay, that did not work. I am having issues. This is this is why I'm having issues. I need to jump down, charge it up, go. No. Okay. Come on. Work with me here. Come on. Come on. Come on. Work with me. Jump. There you go. You almost had it. You almost had it. Okay. No. All you had to do was just okay. Just get next to the edge. Jump for it. Okay. I know you can do this. You're better than this. Go. There you go. Jesus. Okay. <sighs> Alright. Whoa. A bunch of bats that I don't need. Because I'm full on food. I need to go! Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Ow! Ow! <laughs> Ow. Ow. <laughs> I'm 
Great. More backtracking. Yeah, I needed to go that way. It's just... Man, oh man. Okay. I don't know how to feel about that. Hey! No, my food! No! Ah! <laughs> no! Damn it. Okay. Yeah, I don't know what... Ah, fuck. Yeah, I don't know what that that fake rope does, but I don't want to know. What are you trying to say? Why are you telling me to go that way? Get out of here. Okay. I'm gonna bring my staff with me because I know... I'm gonna fuck around and find out. Okay. Which way did I go? I went down in this way. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Let's keep going this way. I don't... I think we're in the sewers now or something, but... Again... I need to, like... We're doing the right thing. So, for us to continue... Oh! I see. Yep. So, we needed... We need to be... We need to hibernate again. So, I need to hunt and hibernate. And then go up a level. And then we can actually go that way. I see. That makes sense. Except for the gatekeeping part. That's kind of dumb. Oh, hey! <laughs> Hi. How did you get in there? Oh, wait, no, wait, come back, come back. Come back, come here. Fucking bitch. I'm eating you. Your food. Thanks. <laughs> Alright. Let's hibernate real quick. And we will continue onward. You fool. You can't get me, bitch. You wanna jump down and try to eat me? Yeah, get out of here. Get out of here, fool. No, oh, don't grab that. I don't know what you are, but don't grab it. <laughs> Any plant that's, like, clearly alive has no feelings whatsoever. They just want to kill you. Alright. Should go up a level, which means we can go through that one area. Alright. Yeah. Awesome. Alright. Just like before, I'm awake. I think the animations of the character is procedurally generated. I don't know exactly what that means. So up there is supposedly an area where I can go. Yeah, get- get attacked, yes. Yes, pull him in! Yes! Yes! Get him! 
<laughs> Alright. I want to jump this way. Grab that. Yes. Nope. Get up. There we go. So what's over here? So we can already go that one way that they were talking about, but supposedly there's something around here. I don't know what exactly just yet. Oh, no. Oh. I don't trust... Yeah, there's really nothing I can do over here. Let me see. Bugs. Oh, yeah, that's right. No, my food. Shit. Nom, nom, nom. Nom, nom, nom. Nice. I need to eat, like... I want to eat that thing. I want to eat some more of those fly things. I killed one up here. Come here. Fucker. Yeah, there's one over there. Yeah! Thank you. Thank you. Nom nom nom. Okay. We're gonna go this way. Hold on. <laughs> okay. No. I need to do it on this thing. Okay. <laughs> Come on. Here we go. Go through here. Alright, we need to be faster about this because there w there's the rain. We can't let the rain get us. I don't know what happens when it rains, but... We don't really have a plan once it happens. Okay. So we need to keep going this way. It, it completely erased the majority of what happened. Oh no, it's right there. Okay. Okay. This place is dangerous. I tell you what, Rick. Okay. That's a little annoying. You want to get in the water? Want to come in the water? Yeah. <laughs> no. I have to time this. I have to be perfect about it. No. I cannot let this thing win against me. Okay. No, 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 no. This way. Okay. Jump! No! Okay, come on. <sighs> Why? Come on. Why do you do this to me? Why does this jump have to be so stupid? Can you not? There. Screw it. Enjoy drowning. Ooh. There's two paths. 
Where's this go? Whoa. I don't think I can do anything here, can I? Whoa. Why is it that this... Why is this... Okay. So I use uh, wall jumping. Oh, dude, nice. Okay. I got the rock. Or whatever this is. We got places to go, baby. I still don't know what this thing does. But... Whoa! Okay. Hold on. Get rid of that. No, get rid of that. Nom, 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 nom. What did that do? <laughs> I still don't know what it does. Okay. <laughs> that just went right through here. Whoa! Oh, I don't need to eat this. Okay, well, drop that. No, drop that. Okay, well. Are you safe? I don't know. Hello? Did it just throw that at me and then miss? I think it's it has its own agenda. I, <laughs> I don't know what, what was the deal with that, but not my problem now. Whatever it was. I need to start jumping more often whenever I can. I want to see where this goes. So, there's not really an, another path other than this way. Let's just keep going until we can see if we can find in uh, like a hidey hole. Because I think it is starting to rain. Either that or this is a new section and the game wants to prove it to us. Sandbox item unlocked? Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Get out of here! Get out of here! Stop it! Stop it! Get away from me. Get away from me. Wait, what? Oh, I see. I see. Come up this. I can't tell if the music is... Okay. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Oh, home. Okay. Get down. Alright. We made it. Job me. I don't know what happened. I I should have watched that animation. All right. Whoa. Ah! Are you safe? Ow. It's kind of cute. Hmm. Well. Huh. 
kind of fun. Let me crawl over here. Can I eat this? What did I pick up? Uh, I don't think I should have eat that. eaten that, shouldn't I? I think this might explode if I throw it at something. I don't know why. It's kind of... Kind of feels that way. Alright, I need to get up there. So I need to do a long jump. I need to do a long jump. Like this. <laughs> I don't know why I keep making that noise. It's just fun. It's fun. Thank you. I will deal with you in a minute. What is this way? Okay. Oh, okay. I got... I jumped down or I... I don't know. I don't know what happened. out of here right oh okay so I need to do like a full kind of jump so I need to do a jump for it okay no dude why okay well maybe the second one I don't need to do that but the first one I do Get ready. Go for it. Let me try. Okay, no. Unless I can grab the chains, which I guess I can't. No. Yeah, no, I cannot grab the chains, so I need to get really close to the edge. And then... Get angry because... Oh, never mind, I can just grab that. Okay. Nom, nom, nom. Okay. So we have two paths. One takes us upwards and the other takes us downwards. Where does this go? This takes us to an in, an in, whatever you call it. And the other way, which, you know, if I can even get up there, I don't think I can. I can try. I don't think I can. Let me see. No. I think I got- I think I just got a trading card. Okay. <laughs> no. Alright, so I have to go this way. Knowledge. I don't know how to get to that. There is a thing right there, but I don't think I can get to it. I think I have to... I- I don't even think I can get to that. To, um... Oh my god. Alright. <sighs> I think I'm in a bad spot. No, I made it. Okay. Let me see. Does this take us anywhere or not? I don't think it does. I, I, I don't think this goes anywhere. I think this is just a dead end. It is. Okay. Can I even get out of here? I don't even think I can get out of here. I think I'm stuck in here. I think this is a dead end. I wonder. 
What happens if I eat this? I don't know. I think I'm gonna spit it out. And then regret eating that. I seriously don't know if I can go anywhere. I don't think I can. Wait. Oh, fuck. I can. I can. I can. Oh, fuck. Wait. No, 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 no. Okay. Oh, fuck. Okay. Okay. We gotta go. We gotta go. Oh, fuck. We gotta go. Oh, dude. This isn't good. Dude, I'm fucked. I'm fucked. Ugh! I'm dead. I can't see. I can't see. I'm dead. Is that what the leaves do? Okay. That's where I died. And that's where I am currently. So we want to go up, if I remember. Okay. Yeah. Oh my god, you idiot. So what if you throw if you throw one of those blue orbs at them they like turn into like a bubble that you can eat or something It's a shame that I died. That is That is a shame. Oh, I can just do this. That's that's good to know. Oh no. What the hell are you? I don't know what that is. And I <laughs> The fuck the fuck just happened? Ugh. I think that was just my. <laughs> what the fuck happened? What's that? What? What was that? Did I freak out over nothing? Drop my controller. <laughs> the fuck? 
I don't, I don't know what that was. Um, something fell on me. It was like kind of soft. I don't know. What was that? Fuck. Pause. Quitting after t 30 seconds into a cycle counts as a loss. Thanks, but I'm not worried about that right now. What was that? I think that was just my shirt? What the hell? Uh. I'm sorry. Okay. That, that was scary. I need food. This is kind of fun, doing all this exploration. I want to see where this goes. Okay, so... Ah, come on. Let's crawl on this. Come on. <laughs> no. Come on. There we go. Okay. Ah. There we go. Whoa, wait. Wasn't I just here, or is this different? No, this is different. That's how you can tell it's gen randomly generated. It's because it has a similar pattern to another room that you have, but there's a little bit of a different to it, a difference to it that wasn't there before. That's how you can tell. What the hell are you? I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna eat you. Come here. Whoa. 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 Hold on, wait. Come on, drop this. Ow. Come here. I wish I could pick this up. Nah. <laughs> Stop that. There you go. Ow. Whoa. <laughs> it's all this is gonna be is just, whoa. Because it's, it's fascinating. It's absolutely riveting. This game is one of the craziest games ever made. A gun. Oh, wow. Okay, so it, it pops. So I have to crawl through here first. Get out of here. Ah, get off of me. These are leeches. These are leeches. I'm dead. <laughs> what? What the hell? That way was weird. Because it was like... You go that way. Come on, give me that. It was like, I, I don't know. 
I want to keep going that way, but I don't know if I can with all the, um, I don't know if I can with all those, uh, leeches or whatever that hold you down. They just straight up will just kill you. It's kind of too late after I went that way. Yeah, I probably shouldn't go the way that that, that's at. That's, that's weird. Dude, that freaks me out. I hate that. I hate that. I hate that. I hate that. I hate that one. Oh yeah, those things, those things will, will eat you, yeah. If you can't kill them, they will fuck you up. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Um, they introduced them pretty, pretty early in this area, from what I can tell. They just, you just don't really deal with them exactly, unless you... Let me eat you. Hold on, let me spit that other one out. Let me throw you. Get out of here. Go away. Ow. Stop that. That's such a cool, that's a really cool effect. Ow, stop. I'm trying to grab this thing. Nom, nom, nom. Yeah, I don't know how I'm going to deal with those leech things. I feel like the game gives you everything you need for it. But... Can I go this way? I need to know. Can I go down this way? No, I can't avoid them. Ow. Stop. I can't. I can't get in there. I'm dead. Okay. I seriously don't know how to deal with these. <laughs> They're too fucked up. I, w I went down another level. Dude. You can't be serious. You can't be freaking serious. <sighs> Alright. Cycle 6 drainage system. Okay. So the other way that I was going before, when I went down, that just takes you somewhere else that's just a dead end. I don't even know how you get out of that area. Um, then the other way just takes you back to another place in which I didn't even go to. If I go this way, there's actually a place down there, but I can't even get to it because you just immediately die. So I have to go through that way to even get to where I need to go, but I can't get there because of these leeches. So I don't know how to deal with the leeches. They're, they're too OP. But I think there's another path if I go this way that I didn't take. That takes you somewhere completely different. There's like another... An entirely another path... Over... This way. Oh no. I made a mistake. 
Well, that is if I can get up there. I can't. Yeah, I made a mistake. Getting back up is going to be annoying. Ow. What the fuck? Ow! I didn't even see... I didn't even see that. Stop it. Stop. I can just go... I can go back up this way. I don't even have to do that whole climbing area. If I just take this path... Come here. You know what? I have an idea. Fuck. I need food. I need food. So if I go down, I guess, I don't know. I go down this way. There's a second path I can take. I don't know where this goes. Oh yeah, this goes to a dead end, right? Yeah. So this actually doesn't go anywhere. If I go the other way, it goes somewhere, but I didn't have enough time to explore it. So I guess I'll try it again. Maybe there's something here that will help me. Maybe there will be something... Yeah, over here. Ah, there's those little fucking... Whatever. No, no, shit. Okay. Fuck off. Come on, please. Okay. Can I not get up there? There you go. I wonder. So this actually goes somewhere. I don't know where it will go, but it'll go somewhere. Hopefully somewhere good. Uh, I don't know. Nom, nom, nom. Extra food. All right, let's see. Where do you take me? This is a new area. Okay. There's more this way. <laughs> no! No!
just come up this. Okay. There's only one path I can go. What the fuck? What are you? Hello? Can I eat you? Whoa. Oh. I see. I did not need to eat these. But that is useful information because I need these to get places. It literally slows down the game. Eat that. Nom, nom, nom. Right, let's go this way. Have I been here before? No, this is a new area. With a... It's just dead end. It's a dead end. Okay. Well, that's good to know. Oh, fuck. Okay. We need to get the fuck out of here. We need to go. We need to go. We need to go. Wait, wait, wait. Shit. I don't remember if this takes me to... Oh, no. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Oh, no. Yeah. Okay. I'm dead. I'm dead. Uh Hold on. Eat it. Go. Ah, my ears. Go. Oh god, I'm right here. I think I'm dead. I'm dead. Okay. Dude. I can't, I can't fucking, like, <laughs> I need to basically eat whatever's in here and then just kill it. Ah, oh, fuck. Okay. There we go. Okay. Yeah, I just need to... I need to just... Go exploring a little bit. And then dip for now or like just I guess just get my lives up oh that's great can you not ow stop it get off stop oh oh god Little newt. Little newt's trying to kill me. Okay. Go this way. Scurry. Scurry, little one. What the fuck are you? Yeah, I don't... I seriously... I think you're you're supposed to kill me. 
but I don't know. I think you kill me. Yeah, I think you kill me. But you are kind of a little weak. Look at you. You're so weak and stupid. But you want to kill me, don't you? See? Look. Look at them. Look at them. So pathetic. What if I threw a rock at it? You think it would like that? Okay. No! Okay. Let's see if I can throw a rock at it and see what happens. I'm kind of curious. Hey! Oh shit. If this rock hurts you, that means you're dangerous. Yes. Hey, this is kind of fun. Yeah, get out of here. Shoo. Yeah, you're angry, aren't you? Look at you. Weird little tree thing. Get out of here. Shoo. Shoo. Oh, you try- did you just try to throw that at me? You little shit? Did you just try to throw that at me? Fuck you. Yeah, that's right, dick. Fucking asshole. You just tried to kill me. The worst part is that getting back to that area is actually like- I don't even think it's possible. I have to just like- I don't know. I have to figure something out here before the rain comes. Because if I don't, then I'm fucked. I need to find those plants. That's what I need to do. I need to find those those slow plants if I can. Because if I can find one of those, then I can... Uh, I did not mean to do that. I meant to do this. I think those, like... I think they're kind of... Dumb. I'm not sure. Stop it. Get off of me. Yeah. Okay. That's a little scary. They're kind of they're kind of a little creepy. Ah. Oh. Okay. I have an idea. Ah, come on. You ready? Bounce! Okay. Actually, why did I do that? There's no reason to do that. Get down in here. Get, get in there. Get in there. No need to drown yourself. Here we go. Get... No, get out of here. Ah, fuck. I think I think I can just go go over there now. Okay, come on. Come on. Get up there. I literally can't get up there now unless I go down in here. Okay, never mind. Let me wait. Whoa. Wait a second. Can I? Can I do that? What's in here? Oh, a path. Wait. Okay, hold up. Oh, fuck. Okay. They. Okay. Where the fuck does this go? Well, I'm dead again. So wait, if I if I lose all the things, then that means I'm I'm gone, right? So that took me to a completely new area. Again, 
those little leech things are just... I, I don't know what to do with them. Supposed to be a little thing here, but I guess not. I guess I've eaten everything. Yeah, um... What the hell is this game? I- I just don't know- Stop! Let go of me! I'm dead. That's as far as you can go. I don't- okay. Kind of annoying that that thing is there now. Give me two. Okay, I can only have one. That little, like, yellow guy is gone now. He's not- he's not with me anymore. Okay, well, now it's chasing after me. Again. I don't know why this thing has to try to kill me. Oh. I'm gonna go down again because I had I've had actual progress when I go down in this way. Whoa, food. I can't get it though. little leeches. Okay. Get in there. Yeah, I want to see what this, like, pearl thing does. Yeah, I don't know what this pearl thing does, but... I'm gonna hang on to it, just in case. I have a feeling that it will help me. Go. Ah! Let's see. Does this pearl thing actually help? I don't know. Little guy's gone, so I can't tell. Come on, dude. Okay, hold on. There you go. There's stuff going on down there and I don't want to know. I'm doing okay on food. But again, that's not the issue. The issue is that I need to... I don't even know what's down there. Is there actually stuff down here? Oh shit, there is. Let's hope it doesn't take me to water. Okay, it takes me to water. Is there anything threatening in this water? As far as I can tell, no. So we're gonna go this way. Get in there. Get in there. There you go. Come on. Crawl, 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 crawl. Go, 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 go. <laughs> okay. Go. Go. Crawl, 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 crawl. Come on. <laughs> okay. Where does this go? Shit. 
I think if I just land in... I think I should be okay if I just go... Okay, hold on. Okay, breathe, go. Okay, go through here, come on. Over, over, okay. Okay. Go, 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 go. Drop down. Okay. Go. This way. Up. Come on. There you go. Alright. We just need to do this. Okay. Come on. Okay. Fuck me. Okay. Why? I literally don't... Th okay. Okay. Oh, I see. Alright. They want you to take a different path. I see. No! No, stop it. Get in there. Alright, hold on. I don't know if this needs air or not. What? What happened? What? What the fuck happened? What? <laughs> okay. Okay, buddy. Yeah. Okay. Sure. Sure. Okay. Okay, this time it didn't even notice me. I think this is the way I went before, um, that time. I think the character drowned. That's the only explanation I can come up with that makes sense to an extent. I, I don't know how it drowned. It just did. Uh, I thought I was above water, but I guess I wasn't. So, it killed me. Did I just kill it? Let me grab my... I don't know if I grabbed it or not. I grabbed the, the orb of destiny, but... Come on, grab it. Uh. 
Oh my god. Dude. Okay. The this is the part that I'm seeing on why the controls are frustrating. It's there's certain parts of it that are just like you just want to get up there. It's the only option you really have at the moment, unless you turn back, which is not really a lot of options there either. There you go. I don't know what I did differently there, other than... I'm going to eat this. As soon as it becomes more safe. I don't know how long... Ah. I don't know what this does. The orb. I'm gonna ponder the orb. So yeah, there's two- there's like... Branching paths here. That take you to different places. And it looks like the one that I took... Was a branching path... To somewhere. That would have taken us somewhere better. I just got killed. <sighs> Dude. Hold on, my internet's dying. I think my internet died. Wait. Okay, we're fine. We're back to it. Oh my god. I want to be the one of the- I want to be the 8% of people that have actually beaten this game. I'm also kind of curious about the... Uh, DLC. Okay, let's try this again, but we're going to be quick about this. I also need to eat as soon as I can. So that's that's another thing. Okay. Get in there. Get in there. I guess the character can drown. That's that's the thing, but I don't know how long it takes for them to drown. I just know I guess it happens or something. There you go. No, give me that. No. Fuck. Okay. This time, let's not get killed by... Grab it! Okay. There's nothing in here this time. <laughs> get in there. Okay. Go. Okay. Platforming time. Platforming time. Drop down. Get in there. 
Go, 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 go. Oh, come on. There you go. Wait, at the bottom? So that's my indication, is the eyes closed, and at the bottom there's a little indication of how long till they drown. Okay. Come on. Get in there. Yeah, you see? Okay. So that was the little indication, I guess. Okay. No, dude! No! God damn it, man! Okay, get off of me. Get off of me. Get off of me. Get off of me. There you go. Come on, come on, go. Get in there. Get in there. <sighs> Alright, this part is fucked up. This is a fucked up part. Get in there. Get in there. Okay. Okay, go, 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 go. God damn it. No, he's dying. He's dying. Get in there. Dude, I'm dead. <sighs> uh, 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 uh. Dude. Fuck that. Okay. Where the fuck? The hell is this? Oh no. No, please don't. Don't do this to me. I just got through that area. Come on. No. No, dude. Please don't. God fucking damn it. There's literally nowhere to go. I'm dead. This fucking blows, man. <sighs> Fuck. Please. 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 No. God fucking- I can't fucking see. Okay, well, I'm dead. What kind of bullshit is that, honestly? What? Okay. So if I go down there, I go down there, that takes me to there. 
I go up there, through there, and then up there, and then I go down through here, this way, and that goes up through there, then that goes up, and then I take this way, and then I, wait, 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 wait. what? Okay, so, I go down there, go all the way through that, and then I go up there, down through this way, down through that way. And then finally I make it up there. I go through that tunnel, drop down, go through there, go through there, go through there. And then come up here, go this way, this way. Then all the way up here is basically where I jump. Wait, what? I don't know where that goes. But at some point, I go into this thing here, through here, and then this way, which takes me all the way over here. And then I fell down an area and then died because I couldn't go any further. And that's, I guess, where I needed to go. I think I need to go this way, but the issue is that I literally can't, apparently. There's, like, a whole area that I need, like, a special thing to do anything there, I guess, in this area. Unless that's from something else. I don't know. I guess that's from something else. Never mind. So, I guess I'm going the right way. I don't know. Um, however, uh, I don't know. God damn it. I got him. Look at that cute little newt. Look at that fucking newt. Look at him. Oh, I didn't even finish it. Oh, that's fucked. I fucked up. Hold on, I need to take both of these somewhere so I can eat it. Nom nom nom, nom nom nom. I need to go that way. No, stop, no! God. <sighs> Fucking shithead. Fucking asshole. I'm so mad. I'm I'm so mad because it's just like you go all the way through that whole area and it's just like oh hey actually um looks like you're not going to be able to do anything buddy. <laughs> you still have like 5 billion uh you have you have like a bunch of areas you need to go left and these guys are trying to kill you by the way. Uh okay. Yeah, you have you have like five rooms that you need to go through uh, before you can get to another safe area. Because fuck you. That's why. Get up there. There you go. I'm gonna eat this. Nom nom nom. Literally doesn't do anything. Just come here. I'm gonna put this in the water. I don't think this thing's going to bother me or do anything. I don't... I have a feeling that if I throw this at uh, one of these guys, it's going to kill it. It's killing me, I think. Actually, I can't tell. 
What I do know is that it's coming for me right now, and I'm having issues climbing up this thing. Get off of me. I'm dead. I Literally, my character would not climb up that pipe, and it just killed me. Just like that. Dude. Look, I played Super Meat Boy. I played Toho. Alright? I've played hard games. I've played Dark Souls and then stopped playing it because I got too angry. No! No! Oh my god. There, the, it better not be in here. G just give me this. I'm going to... Oh, hey! Hi! Nice to see you. I'm dead. This is just depressing. <laughs> this is very depressing. Okay. Oh, there goes me. Haha. <laughs> That's funny. Speed run. Speed run time. Speed run time. The only time I will uh, stop is for the minimum amount of food that I need to live right now. Which is just one thing of food. That's all I'm going to stop for. Maybe. Why didn't uh, I didn't hold the up button? Okay. Okay. That's okay. It's okay. Just. <laughs> I love it. Love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. Nom, nom, nom. Okay. I'll worry about food later. Just need to not die. Don't get fucking murdered, please. Get in there. Please. Get in there. There you go. Go. There you go. There you go. Okay. Just crawl through this. Drop down into it. There you go. Crawl, 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 crawl. Stop. Crawl, 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 crawl. Jump. Grab it. There you go. Crawl, 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 crawl. Drop. Crawl, 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 crawl. Crawling in my skin. These wounds, they will. Okay. Drop down, drop down. Okay, okay. Okay, go in here. Come on! Dude, don't be fucking doing this right now. Come on. Oh my god. I think it literally almost died. Why? Why do you do this? Okay. 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 
Okay. Okay, crawl. No. Get up there. Get up there. Get up there. Get up there. Drop. Go down, go down. No delays, no delays. Come on. Let's go. This is the part where I died. Okay. We actually got to this area. I can kind of, like, focus. Wall jumping is a little bit... Is kind of awkward. in this, because you have to basically... Be kind of holding in that direction or whatever. It's hard to explain, but... It's like... I don't exactly know, like, if you if you let go of the analog stick, your character's just gonna drop like a brick. They're not gonna continue. I need to make this jump and not fall down into it. I guess that's what can kill you. If you're not careful. I kinda can't really see. Which I guess is the point. I hope that I can get somewhere safe. I can. I can hibernate here. Now, <laughs> we are at an impasse here because I need to be a very high level at this point. Uh, which means I'd have to backtrack. I have no way of continuing forward. Which sucks. I literally have no way of continuing forward. I need to basically hibernate like two more times which I can't do yet I need to hibernate two more times for me to get anywhere I can't even see either okay well yeah, I'm not I'm not high enough level yet. But that's good to know, I guess. Drainage system. So we're gonna head back up and I guess go hunting. Yeah, see, it's very awkward to do this. I don't know if... I don't think that goes anywhere. I think it just... Yeah, I don't think that goes anywhere. I think that's just a drop. Just uh, just to, to fuck with you. Like, it's just a drop straight down to the, the monster that can kill you right here. Whatever the fuck that thing is, it, it will kill you. Yeah, that's literally just a drop. Yep. <laughs> that is all it is, and if you fall into it, 
uh, you're going to have a hard time wall jumping back out, basically. Anyways, I need to go kill things, which it's not going to be in here. I literally have to go really far away for me to um, get food, pretty much, from the hole that I walked all the way to. Uh, there's nothing here, really. Um, it's just, uh... Come on, climb up. I'm doing this, like, upside down. Okay. Nope. I did not make it. I don't know where this, uh, hole goes. Um, all I can assume is that it will kill me. That is what I can assume. Okay, I'm gonna try to just jump- no. I don't think... I think I'm stuck here. I I don't know if I can make that. I don't know if I can make that jump. No. I don't know if I can make that jump. There is no food for me here. No. Where does this go? New area! Oh, hi. Oh, great. What is this? I don't know where this goes, and I think it's going to kill me, so I need air as soon as possible. I think there's air right here. I'm dead. I'm dead. Well, there goes all of my progress. Um, literally. <laughs> Great. <laughs> awesome. This game teaches you to never die. Or else you are fucked. <laughs> I don't know if you can soft lock yourself in this game. I think technically you can't. I'm literally trying my hardest. I this doesn't go anywhere. I don't know where I am. I, I see why people complain about the controls. The wall jumping specifically is the part that I have the issue uh, a a issue with. I have everything else is okay. Um, that that right there is probably the worst part of the movement. Is the wall is the wall jumping? It's not as intuitive as rest of this game I don't know what they mean by um the anim like the animations are procedurally generated or whatever the fuck they said I think I just died Oh no, I'm fine I would like to get up there but I don't think I can. I think I have to go this way. I think it didn't hear me because I didn't make any noise. Okay, go. What the fuck are you doing? I'm dead. Okay. I seriously don't know where that goes. This is so stupid. Because I'm like, I'm sitting here trying to... God. I need to see. I need to see. Can you soft lock yourself in this game? Is 
offline? I, I'm stuck in the drainage system over, um, over by the filtration system door. The only way out seems to be a flooded area, but I can't seem to find any air pockets. Is if that is the case, any ideas? I definitely feel that I am in the position where I'm legit just soft locked. This is a notorious place to soft lock by. Uh, this is a notorious place to soft lock by newbies. It teaches you two things. In order to preserve your air, you should swim slower, and avoid leeches. P.S. You can also theoretically build a bridge to the upper shaft if you choose the upper right path. But 19 out of 20 attempts, you will not have enough time to do it before the uh, the rain begins. And won't be lucky enough to have four spears spawned there. PPS. The kelp in the bottom right zoom is completely harmless. Does not help. Never mind, I figured out pretty much... You just gotta get good at swimming like everything. I read... What? Wiggling side to side to achieve speed? Never press A. It drains your oxygen like mad. So me pressing A killed me. Faster. You gotta be fucking kidding me. You gotta be fucking kidding. <laughs> okay. Let's try that again then. Let's see. Wiggle side to side, they say. I, I'm gonna attempt to do that. I don't know how it's gonna work. So this game is entirely involved around you um, learning the 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 fucked up movement system. You you have to learn it. You have to learn to use it. Okay. don't know if these are harmless or not. I think they make them look threatening, but I don't think it kills you. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, there's another one. But again, you have to like, do all this other stuff. Watch this. Ugh. You can do a little roll if you, if you hold down as you're falling. You can do a little roll. Just fun. But yeah, you, you basically need to Practice swimming. It's supposed to train you, I guess. I guess this game... I guess maybe it isn't procedurally generated, because if someone's having the same issue, then, yeah, I unless... I don't know. I guess this is, like, the exact same... I guess this thing doesn't hurt you. Apparently. It's just hanging out. So this is the bottom whatever the fuck they said. Okay. Okay. Okay, come on. <laughs> so fucking funny it's so funny it's so funny <laughs> uh, 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 uh. 
<laughs> no. Uh, no, I had it. I had it. I had it. I had it. I li I'm literally just guessing, though. I don't know exactly what they mean by wiggling if they want you to wiggle kind of like similar to the tail. So like left to right, left to right if you're swimming upwards. You know, like kind of like, kind of like, I don't know. And then like if you're swimming down sideways, you need to kind of, kind of like, I don't know, dude. So like way they explained it is a little bit weird. Because how I've been doing it is not the way that they're, I don't know. And don't ever hit A. So. I guess they, they just assume that everyone who plays this game is playing on. Um. Okay. Yeah. I don't know. Okay. For. <laughs> okay, that didn't work. I tried. I don't know how else you get to those other parts. But apparently this thing's harmless. Okay. Attempt four or five, I don't know anymore. I, I, I seriously don't know. Okay. 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 I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try. Go. Wait for it. Okay, go. Get in there. This is a long section. Oh my god. There is a little bit of a air pocket. I just need to get past this part. Okay. Come on. I'm gonna do what they say. And wiggle myself into it. Like so. Okay. Alright. There's a little bit of a pocket right there. Let's go. Okay. Go down. Go down. Go down. You know what? Go up, go up, go up, go up, go up. Okay. Okay. <sighs> go. Okay. Go down. What? What? You know what, game? You're fucking killing me here, you know this? You know that? You're killing me. Doing this on purpose. You're killing me on purpose, aren't you? You gotta teach me a lesson. Hey, okay, come on. Fucking little fuckhead. Okay, no. You have to do it the way that they want you to do it, which is... Okay. 
Right. Well, at least we found a, like, a thing. But still, it's just like, god damn. Attempt 17. I keep looking at it, buddy. Alright. Uh, hope that you don't die. Go in. Okay, let's do this. Okay. Come on. No. Come on. Up. There you go. Breathe. Breathe. I think he's breathing. I can't tell. Okay. I I think we're okay. It's really hard to do this part. Okay. Take a second. <sighs> Go. Hi. Okay, go. Alright, let's see. Can I get in there? <laughs> That's the question. Can I get in there? Oh, there's these stupid fucking leeches. That's what's killing me. These guys were what, kill what killed me. Were these things. Oh, God. Oh, no. Get off of me. Just explode. There you go. Ah, get up there. Okay. All right. All right. We're actually getting food. Okay. Alright, so we just need to get over there. Nom nom nom. Nom nom nom. Nom nom. Nom nom nom. Nom nom nom. Okay. Okay. Alright, so we have a bunch of these things that are harassing me. Alright, so we need to go that way in order for us to progress. Fuck me. Let's go. Get in there. Get in there. Get in there. Go, 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 go. Ah, oh, these fuckers. They're harassing me. Yeah, they're just gonna harass me, aren't they? Get in there, get in there, get in there! No! Fuck off! Oh my god. Stop it. Okay. They're all on me. Stop it. I'm dead. I'm dead. I can't get up there. I can't get up there. I'm dead. <sighs> oh, dude.
This game is fucked. Oh my god. This game is so fucked, dude. <sighs> death, 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 death. That's where it goes? Why is there like 50 million of those stupid leeches? Why? Why? And I have to like swim through that to get to there. Is that what it's telling me? Dude, that's so fucked. And that doesn't even take me to like a safe area. Oh my god. Fuck this game. Oh my god. <laughs> It literally is a fucking noob trap to come here. I, I don't know. I don't know why they did this. <laughs> why did they design the sewers to be Blight Town? Like 2.0. Why did they do that? Do they know? I won't say that it's, like, not fun. I do just find it a little... I do find it difficult. That is what I'm saying. It is difficult. I'm not saying it's unfun. I don't... <clears throat> I don't know. I'm not exactly a... Somebody who would say... That this is... That challenge is a fun thing. I don't necessarily... I don't know. I like a fair challenge. That's what I'm trying to say. But I do... I do think I understand what they're going for. Is that it's difficult on purpose. Like, all hard games. It's supposed to, I guess, artificially show the brutality of nature in a more natural, at least a more natural way than other games do. That is what I've gotten from this. Come on. There you go. Come on. I don't know how much longer I can take uh, dying over and over again. I don't know how much longer I can take it. This is this next section, dude. And I can't get to it. Because I am busy trying to not die. Um, or I'm busy going backtracking because I don't have enough ways to eat. And it, once I get out of the area that I'm going to... Like, once I get to that area that has food, I literally can't even go back to this area until I loop around. So it's literally the lar like a massive, long-ass loop that I have to take. And then I have to just be prepared, pretty much. Because if I'm not prepared... Because if I'm not fucking prepared... If I'm not uh, the highest possible level you can be... Then, yeah. This was such a mistake. It was such a mistake. They, they fucked me on purpose. And they make it pur purposefully difficult to get out of this area once you get here if, you're, if your character is not that level like it should be. They make it easy to traverse at the 
at the first part of the game, they make it so you can easily try to go back if you're not uh, in a high enough level. And then this one, um, the sewers decide, or the drainage decides to go in for the kill. It's like, aww. So you, you're not a high enough level now? Okay. Well, um, we're not going to let you hibernate ever. Uh, and the fact that I even even got anywhere close to hibernating. Yeah, look. Okay. I'd need another one to get up there. I'd need another one to get up here. Because if I drop down there, that's going to drop me down to an area that uh, I think is completely inaccessible entirely. I'm dead. I love it. 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 I guess the the this at the end of the story is um, if you can't get past uh, the reach infest the reach the leech infested waters uh, that await you up here, then uh. You aren't fit for um, survival. You need to go back, uh, reassess your your situation, and um, I guess try again. I don't know if this is randomly generated. Uh, I guess it it's not. I need to look into it. Um, No, I had it. I don't... Okay. That's the one thing that's, like, annoying is because I can't tell if you're... How how close do you have to be to the ledge for you to basically jump again and then you grab the ledge, right? Okay. Okay. I did the little wiggling, so it's like very slight. You don't have to do like big ones. You just do little small ones like this. There you go. Yeah. See? I'm going to wait a second. You don't have to do big ones. You can just do small ones. Like that. You don't have to do big ones. Just small ones. Go in here. Swim in. Okay. God damn it. Alright. Right. Ooh, bats. That's food. It's a shame that I have to continue.
wait. There's one leech. There's another leech. Okay. I just need to fucking swim. And then get into that little pocket of air, I guess. But I have to dodge the fucking annoying ass leeches. Go into here. Swim. Come on. Get in here. Get in here. Get in here. No! Get in! Get in! Get in! Get in! Get in! Get in! Yes! Oh no, I'm dead. Oh, fuck. That's where I needed to go. Shit, man. Fuck. So they give you all that food in that one little area so you can restart and go through the entire loop all over again in one go, pretty much. Unless you can find... I, I forget... I, I'm, I'm probably going to die here anyway, so I'm going to see here. So if I go this way, that takes you over here, through here, and then you go up. And in this area, I think you can go back through here. You'd have to go all the way through this, jump over, and then you'd have to go all the way over here, then up there, into there, and then you're safe. So I basically have to do a complete loop and then just farm for whatever you call it, pretty much the entire time. But I'd have to do that in one run here, which I don't think I can do. I'd have to basically plan my route and then do it faster than I did before, pretty much. But now I see why there's a random path there. Uh, it's because they want you to, um, yeah. What's annoying is that they have those pockets there for air and it's literally just a beginner's trap again. It's all just a beginner's trap. You just need to fucking rush it. You need to fucking rush it as fast as you can. It's that's so fucked up. Once you see the leeches, you need to just go for it pretty much because they will apparently drag you down. I don't think they kill you outright immediately, but the more there are, the more it basically hurts you. I'm going to assume that's what is happening. <sighs> Let's try it again. Get in there. Get in there. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, they're they're fucking back. No, dude. You can't do this to me. Get in there. Get in there. I'm dead. Okay. You drown between uh, traversing areas, I guess, or something. I don't know. Dude. Now, technically, you don't lock... At least you don't technically soft lock yourself, right? 
It's technically not a soft lock. It basically is. You're just gonna be sitting here doing this, uh, for a while. Um, so... That's fucking sick, dude. I'm gonna do this. I hate seeing this part over and over again. I wanna see new stuff. I wanna see new environments, but this game is literally fucking gatekeeping you. <sighs> like, I'm literally, I, in the literal sense, this game is gatekeeping you. In the quite literal sense of the word, you're being gatekept. But yeah, no, this game is is a skill issue game. <laughs> this game is is a skill issue game. In the sense that you need to basically uh, constantly practice or hone in your skills or whatever of the movement system. Apparently there is mods for this game though. I've never seen them yet, but they they exist. I think the worst part about... I'm not going fast enough. Yeah, I'm dead. I'm dead. My character won't wouldn't wiggle. I don't... I wasn't wiggling fast enough, I guess. I, I, dude. Oh my fucking god. I swear I was doing the same thing. I swear I was sitting there going... Like this. I was fucking doing that the entire time. Oh my god. <sighs> oh, fuck me. I'm almost half like Wanting to just fucking give up uh, stream-wise and then maybe attempt it on my own uh, because this is kind of boring to watch, honestly. Oh my god. Come on. Come on. Calm the fuck on. Just go. Go, go, go. No. Go, 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 go. Okay. Don't fall down this fast because you will just fucking die. Okay. Attempt 7 billion. I don't know. I don't know anymore. I'm gonna hope that my character... Okay. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Go. Up. Okay. Oh my fucking god. They almost died. <sighs> yeah, no, I, I don't know. I'm doing exactly how you need to do it. Look at that. They're all, they almost died just now.
I'm gonna die again. I'm gonna die again. I I'm dead because my character wouldn't go. Okay. I'm starting to think I don't need to wiggle it. Yeah, th those things are gonna get killed. Wait, what the fuck did I just eat? See you later, nerds. Come on. No! I didn't want to do that. Alright, back to attempt, Ugh. I just want these things to go away, I just want them, I want them to go away, I want them to go away, I just want to swim into here and then not be harassed by leeches everywhere, please tell me it didn't see me, okay, go. 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 I beat it. I did it. I got past this fucking portion. Again. Ah, oh, fuck. Okay, I just need to make it back to that one area. And then I'm pretty much safe for now. Okay. Okay, go. Oh, come on. There you go. Let's go back. Turn back. Get in there. And then I need to basically wall jump my way back up. Like so. No, I... Oh my fucking god. Just crawl up. Okay. No. See, that's what I'm talking about. That's exactly what I'm talking about. It's like, why the fuck does it do that? It's like, you don't know how close you need to be to that wall until it... Go over there. Get out of here. Alright. Let's see if we can make it back. I just... I don't want to do this again. I don't want to run all the way back here. I, this is my chance. And I don't know if the game's going to give it to me or not. Because I had to hang out in that one area to heal, or whatever. And that little eyeball thing literally fucked off. I don't know where it went. Oh my fucking god, just go. Just go, just go. This is an endurance right here. This is a fucking endurance. And they know it. Go away. Oh my god. Okay. 
I'm almost done. I'm almost back home. Or whatever you want to call it. I just fucking need to get through this area. And then basically, I just need to farm here. This is my farming area. No, why did I do that? Okay. Good thing it can't get to me. Unless it, it literally wraps onto me here. I don't think it will. Okay. Fuck you. Fuck off. Okay. Alright. We made it back to this place. Literally, like... I, I don't even know anymore. This is probably my... I don't know. What I do know is that... I finally made it. I need a fucking drink after that. <laughs> I need a drink. Alright, there's one. That... Multiple more times. <laughs> Oh my god. Okay. Alright. I'll be right back. I'm gonna... Okay. Whew. We just need to farm. We need to farm. That's what the game wants us to do. And then attempt to make it over to that one area. We need to attempt so we go we so we go that one way we came which is i guess through there down over over there then we have to jump through there go through there and then drop down through there get through that whole thing go through there go through there and then, you know, after we do all that, we can attempt, we can go through there, go through this whole thing, and then we can continue. That's what we have to do. But we have to do that all 
in one r uh, run, we have to do it quick and fast. We just have to basically stock up on whatever the fuck that thing is whenever we hibernate. I don't even know what it does or what it means. I don't know. I don't know if you can eat these. I guess not. They're just there to be annoying, I guess. But I feel better. Like, I'm not joking. After going through, finally getting through that area and getting back to here, I feel significantly better than before. Because I know... There's a couple dead ones there now. Or something. It's just like flies. They're literally just like acting just like flies. I missed. Entirely. I get it? I got it. Okay. Alright. That's one. here all right we got our levels or whatever let's go back to hibernating again num 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 and then I think there's a thing here. There is. We can eat this. If they get low enough, I can hit one of them. I don't think they will. Hold on. I have an idea. Whatever. We're ready. We're actually full now. If there's one thing I wish this game did was to give you an evolution system. That's what this kind of needs. If they're going to do a Rain World 2, give the Slugcats the ability to evolve. So then it's definitely more of an RPG kind of game to where you can choose your evolution and your character does change in physical form as you're doing so. So like, oh... They have, um, like, frog legs. You know, just like a, a real-world example. Like, real animal example. So that means they can jump higher. You know, like, they can, uh, they can, if they absorb or do, you, you could even use absorption as, like, a feature. Kind of like Kirby, except it's more uh, realistic, I guess you could say. Yeah, there is no food here this time around. Which is not good. Which means I might have to go into an earlier area. There's one. Get over here. Ah, oh, fuck. Fine. Good thing those things are popping the newt. Because it's, uh... I need to kill these things. Got both of them. Num num num. Num num num. Technically, here's what I'm thinking. So I currently have enough to hibernate. I have enough to hibernate. 
I'm gonna do that. So, technically we could do it. I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna get to the max level that I can get before we continue. And then have another max level on top of that, basically. Something like that. I don't know. We'll see. Serious kind of RNG. I don't know. I just wish the game would give me just enough. I mean, I could do it now, but again, I'm not prepared right now. So hopefully there's food over here. I don't know if there is. Doesn't look like there is, so I'm just gonna go. Oh no, there's food here. There's food here this time around. Where'd my food go? I, I let go of that shit. Okay. No, stop. My food! Stop it. Ugh. See you later, nerd. I need to grab those as soon as I can. Ugh, come on. Okay. I have a plan. Arthur. Get down. Drop down. Grab it. Stop it! I'm dead. Okay. Well, I dropped down a level. Which means I have to do this part some more. I have to stay here even longer. And that is why I hate this part. <laughs> Welcome to my tech talk. to master the art of eating these fucking insects. Nom 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 nom. They're coming. Get them. I wish the screen transitioned better. That's my one that's a complaint that I have. The screen like jerks whenever it tran uh, transitions into another area. You see what I mean? So it's like, it's hard for me to follow my character because they do the screens in a weird way. Where it's just, it's a little off putting. I, I Maybe there's a mod for it. That's what this game definitely needs, is, def is that. Come here. Come here, fucker. Got him. Get away. No, dude. Uh we're going back down levels. We're going back down levels. We're 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 stuck in a loop. We're fucking stuck. Cuz that stupid fucking newt that just it's just camps there. I'd literally have to deal with that. 
Used to not be there, as far as I'm aware. But now it's just there forever. And now I'm fucking just... <sighs> I'm getting more and more frustrated again. Because I keep dying. And it's really just annoying. Dying over and over again. Be patient. Strike when necessary. Oh, great. They're all hanging out there. There we go. Come here, fuckers. Stop running. There. Okay. We can hibernate again for the 50th time. And I guess just sit here and farm these because, um, I don't, I don't know. This is one of those features that I, because... I don't know. I think this is kind of dumb, this whole gatekeeping system. This part here. This, where I have to be at a threshold of that weird symbol there, for me to progress any amount, is a little bit annoying. I understand that you want to add um, playtime to your game, but this is an artificial way of doing it that's not necessarily fun. Uh, because progression is always important in video games. You always want to have some kind of way of making the f player feel like they're progressing on something. That's why Isaac works as a roguelike is because you're constantly unlocking new items. You are constantly progressing in the game um, where you are getting more things to play with in your, pl uh, in your sandbox. And that's, uh, that, that's why it works. We need to wait for flies or whatever to spawn here so we can, or at least come in here, so we can eat it. I might have to, I might have to go all the way over. I don't know. Because I don't have enough to hibernate. If I go back that way... There we go. Oh shit. I just killed that thing. On accident. Or something. I don't know what just happened there. Alright. Well. I need to basically... I need to do this again. I need to kill four things plus three. 
level up again, and then make it so I can... I only need to eat a couple things, because there's those squids on the way. Those little octopus thingies that are hanging out in the dry air, for whatever reason. We need to eat those. Um, and those should give us enough to hibernate at the next location. If we can get there, you know, fast enough. So, we're not doing it here. I don't know if this game is just making it more and more difficult for me to get any amount of food. Because that's what it feels like. It feels like this game is purposely making it more and more annoying to get any any food. When you're at a higher level or something. Let me see. I'm gonna hang out here and see what happens. Actually, I don't know why I'm doing that. There's no reason for me to do that. But... Because I, I have such a... I don't know. At this point, I need to just go somewhere where there's food, pretty much. And I think the game is trying to indicate that there's food up over here. Up in that area, which means I have to go back. Which I can do, I guess. I just need to make this jump. Let's go into here and see if we can find any food. Here we go. Oh, okay. Okay. You want to climb onto that? There you go. There's a newt here. You want to try to come kill me? Uh, oof. There we go. There's food. How the fuck? Oh, great. Great. Oh, I needed to go down. Well, back to, um, round one. <laughs> Time to do this all over again. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> well, at least I know there's food that way, I guess. I just need to not die there again. That would be great. Oh, wow. I'm up here now. Bugs! Yeah, get over here, fucker. I'm gonna fucking eat you. No, get back. Get back. I'm sorry. I'm just kidding. I'm just joking. I'm just joking, dude. I'm just joking, dude. Mac! Is that the, uh, the funny newt? Is that the newt? No. Nom nom nom. Okay. Attempt number 35 on... Get over here. There's those, like, time things or whatever.
God damn it. Come here. Fucker. Wait, where does this go? Oh, that goes somewhere else. Wait, 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 wait. Does that just take me to there? Huh? If I go that way... Alright, hold on. I'll figure this out in a second. Can I climb up this? No, they want you to do this. Or do they? I don't know what they want you to do anymore, because now I'm stuck over here. There you go. Okay. Get over here, you fuckers. Nom nom nom. Nom nom nom. You're coming with me, bitch. I don't know where that newt went, but I don't want to know, to be honest. I like how there's like a bunch of those things on there. I, I literally can't make that jump, so um, I literally need to do this. Oh yeah, I remember now. I had to crouch down and then jump for it like that, and then jump, and then jump, and then jump over, like this. Crawl down into here, and then slumber. There we go. This is my- this is my chance, basically. I need to go now. Like, I need to go on this run and just make it. That food's gone. I need to go as fast as I can. I don't know if the other way is fast or not. I don't know. What I do know is that I need to fucking just book it, you know? Just go. Just fucking go. Just go. Oh, there's another one. Well, at least there's more flies or whatever you call them here. I don't even know what you call them. But I don't want to be in that area. Okay. Go. Drop down. Go. Get in there. Get in there. off. Get in there. Okay. Come on, stop getting stuck. 
Dude, don't fucking die. Come on. <sighs> okay. Get in there. Okay, go. Come on. Dude, what? Dude, no. Don't- don't make me do this, dude. No. No. <laughs> oh my god. Uh... <laughs> god fucking damn it, dude. <sighs> You're fucking killing me, game. You are fucking killing me. <sighs> you are fucking killing me so goddamn much, dude. You are so fucking killing me. I'm- I'm dead. I'm dead. I might as well be dead. Don't go up there, you fucker. You fucking dick. No! Why is there another one? Why is there another one? Oh my fucking god. Two steps forward, two steps back. 20 million steps forward, 20 million steps back. You never- you never make progress in this game. Ever. Other than the first section. Which I guess I saw for about an hour. And now I'm- I've been seeing the drainage system for two fucking hours. I'm- I'm tired of this area. I'm tired. I'm tired of seeing this area. I just wanna get the fuck out of here. Stop grabbing that. Don't grab that. Stop! No! No! No. 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 Fuck off. Fuck it, no. The thing freaks me out. I don't like it. Not at all. I don't like it. Not at all. Get back here. Now. Get here. Come here. Got you. Nom nom nom. Coming to here. Oh. 
One more. Okay. We're good. Attempt whatever at this point, I guess. If I can make it. I'm just waiting for this game to fucking kill me again. In a really dumb way. Like it always does. Ow. Come on. I'm not I'm not touching that. <sighs> Time for a tempt. I love the tempt. I love it, 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 I love it. I love it. Slumber time. Wow, look at that. Look. Look. Oh no. Oh no. I'm looking for who asked? What what cycle am I on now, game? <laughs> How many points are you gonna deduct from my end game once I finish it? After I get cycle 50. Yeah, cycle 15. In the drainage system. Wow. Don't fall in the water. Watch out for the newts. Ha 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 ha. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. No, don't even try. Don't even try. Just get the fuck out of here. Again. Come here. Not done with you, fucker. I got it. Nice. Nom nom nom. Everything else is extra at this point. No leeches this time. Guess the game thought that that was a little broken. Maybe? No, probably not. I think the game still doesn't give a shit. It will be as difficult as it wants to be. I don't know why I do that when it's completely pointless. There you go. Nom nom nom. Just need to go. I just need to go. I just need to go. I just need to go. Oh, great. The newt's there. Oh, great. And now I have to go through this area again. Dude. Let's fucking go, dude. I'm fucked. I'm literally fucked. Let's go. Unless... Wait. Hold on. Please tell me I can get out of this area. No. I think, I think the hole's too big. I think it literally is too big. Yeah, it's too big. It's too big of a hole. They fucked me. Again. The game f found a way to completely fuck me over because of my... Fucking... Idiocy. I have to literally... I'm dead. I literally will die. I'm literally gonna die. Okay, cool. Thanks, game. Thanks, game, for fucking me. I'm ready. Here we go. Oh, great. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead because I can't- I couldn't move. I couldn't move. I'm dead. What a waste of, uh, time. What a waste of fucking time. I love it. I fucking love it, dude. Take two steps forward, two steps back. Let's go. Let's fucking go. I love it. I love never making progress, ever. I love being stuck in this- in the fucking drainage system for the rest of my fucking character's existence. I love it. Despite my efforts of attempting to get the fuck out of this place and continue the game and see cool shit and continue to see more of this cool shit, right? Uh, the game just wants me to hang out here, uh, forever.
Forever and ever and ever. Let me just slowly dwindle the population of these things until I basically soft lock myself. Again. I don't want to go down there because I don't need to. I can just do this. All right. Four steps forward, four steps back. We're never seeing the rest of this game because I somehow get completely uh, unlucky and or whatever it may be or skill issue and then I somehow fuck myself and then have to keep doing it again. By the way, I've not gotten a single achievement just wanted to mention that. Not a single achievement. There's 34 achievements in this game. Not a single one. I don't even know if they exist. Wait until there's 30 newts in this area. It's like, uh, it's like stocks. They just multiply. Look at them. Just hanging out, ready to kill me as soon as I walk there. But you know, this is the way they want you to go. Don't get the aim wrong. This is where, where you need to go. Right over here. Right, get in there. Okay. Attempt. Again. I don't know why. Why are you doing this to me, game? All of a sudden. Why am I suddenly fucking this part up? I, I literally cannot be delaying at all. Because if I'm delaying, then I'm literally gonna die because the rain's gonna get here. Okay. I'm dead. Because I'm I'm taking too much time. I literally cannot spend any time here. Or else uh I'm literally okay. I don't know why it's doing this to me. I don't know why. My character was just like, yeah, you know what? Sure, I want to die today. If the newt's right there, I can't tell. Okay. Get in there. I have to do this part faster. So if I'm not doing this faster, then, uh, yeah. Once my character wants to wall jump, once, uh, once slug cat wants to, I don't know, function. You know, your life depends on it. At a time it worked. At a time, you know what, what's it, what, fucks me over is the part where I'm I'm hitting up or I'm holding up whenever I drop down here and I still fall fall down all the way and then my character doesn't want to wall jump. Wanna not die? Okay. 
Okay. Okay. I timed it, I guess. I don't know. Get in there. Hold on. Okay. Ow. Oh yeah, we still have to go through this whole section. Wait for a second. Go. You almost had it. Come on. Go, 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 go. No. Get up there. You fucking idiot. Oh my god. You fucking dumbass. <sighs> I'm not even there yet. I already know it. I'm not even close to being there yet. I still have a whole other section to go. Just down through here. Go, 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 I just have to fall through there. I I'm so close. I'm so fucking close. Come on, come on. Okay. We're almost there. Come on, drop down. Okay. Come on. Huh. Come on. Climb. Okay. <laughs> Come on. I did it. Oh, fuck. Okay, I'm, I need to get food. I need to get food. I don't know if food's going to be around this area. I don't know how much harder this game's going to make it. I have a feeling that uh, it's not going to be nice regardless. I have a feeling that there's going to be no food over here. And that if I die in this area before uh, getting enough food, I'm going to have to attempt that whole area all over again. Uh, so we have about two attempts for this section. I We're in the filtration system. I don't even know what's where to walk. There's a thing there. Where's this way go? 
I literally can't see. What the fuck is going on? Okay. What the hell is going on? I don't like the filtration system, I'm gonna be honest. Me no likey the filtration system. What the hell? I literally- okay. Okay. Don't drop down. <laughs> Where's this go- I'm falling. What? What is this game doing to me? Why? Okay. Oh, great. This thing is... I'm dead? I don't know. <sighs> I need to get the fuck out of here. What? Okay. I'm gonna... Go into this one. Uh, hope I don't run into him. I don't know where I am. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't... What is this game teaching me? Is that nothing you do matters or what? I don't... I'm gonna go this way. I think that thing's following me. I think it knows uh, that I'm going somewhere that it... Doesn't want me to go. I think, uh, I don't know if I'm going the right way. <laughs> oh god. Okay. Okay. I go down now. Um. This, um, maze section is kind of, <laughs> kind of bad. It's kind of not good. I have an idea. Uh, I'm going to cheat. Uh, this game... This game wants me to, um... Basically, I'm going to turn the contrast up so bad. Let me see. What's the contrast look like without it? Okay. Gamer mode. K. 
gamer mode. Looks better when the brightness is not turned up. Okay, well, I guess this is the best I can do for me. All right, let's see if that helped. I don't know if you guys can see better or not. I don't know. I have no idea on how I'm supposed to get to there. Because I can't... I can't really wall jump there. And this path down here, I don't think takes me to... It doesn't take me to it. Yeah, it doesn't take me to it. It just takes me to these. Which is not what I needed. Yeah, this doesn't go anywhere. Yeah. So that doesn't take me to it. Where does this go? I guess I can try this way. Okay. Where the fuck am I? This literally doesn't go anywhere. This thing's coming to kill me. We're back to the same exact issue as before. I think I'm gonna get rained on. I think, yeah, the rain's gonna happen. I literally, wow. Wow. So there is an area I can go, but I'm dead, basically. It's too, it takes too long to get to where I am. There's no, there's no like way of, of healing. Yeah. That's so sad. That's so stupid. Wow. Filtration system. Filtration system. Good shit. Good shit. It's awesome. Well, I need to basically do this right next time. I'm not I'm I'm done. <laughs> I'm fucking done. <laughs> Ooh, does this game piss me off? What regions do we got? We have the drainage system, because that's a lot of fun. This is the outskirts of what I explored, by the way. Drainage system, outskirts. Those are the only places that I finished. Each one's worse than the last. <sighs> That's just sad. That's just... That's just sad. Why did it open up? Uh, why did it open up? Um, I did not know. <laughs> Rain world filtration system. What a fucking awful map. Dark, dimly lit maze of pipes and shafts connected to a subterranean th through four unique tunnels. Lack of illumination makes exploration challenging without a light source. The subregion is also inhabited by a large number of black lizards, which can easily hunt and corner. Oh, <laughs> what a great... What a great game. All right. Oh, was, they call it karma. I was close to the end, but I got to the drainage system by mistake. It got stuck there by the gate. It requires level four karma. Oh, yeah, I know. 
stuck at the red gate at the bottom of the map. What do I do now? The only way it seems to go a longer underwater way. I have been trying to get to the shelter, but I always die because of the leeches or run out of time. At this point, I feel like restarting the game would be easier. This part is just so brutal. Also, is it normal to get the si to cycle 100 at this point? I died so many times doing dumb stuff. Damn. As far as I know, the path you encountered is is a one way to the uh to the position you're just as of right now. Go all the way back to the farm raise and get through the other side, which sucks just as much. However, if you don't have enough karma, I wouldn't suggest farming in the drainage since food is pretty scarce and the risk of drowning for some stupid reason is always around the corner. There's possibly going back to the outskirts to farm karma, then come back when you are all set. Don't worry about the cycle count. My first playthrough was in the 200s. Damn. That's tough. There is, in fact, a map... <laughs> Uh, there is a map. Um, I almost uh will, you know, I'm not a person who is about mazes when I'm in a time constraint. That is probably one of the dumbest things you can possibly do in a game, is not only do you have a filter, like an entire maze system, which is this entire game to begin with, but you are on a time limit when you are in that area. And if a maze is going to be putting you on a time limit, you only have like a couple attempts to do it. This game is fucking brutal. And that's 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 the fair point is that it is it is actually genuinely fucked up. So farmer rays, which I've never been there before. Scavenger merchant shoreline. I don't even know what shoreline is, but we're in the drainage system, which is where we were. Yeah, this map doesn't really help me because I can't zoom into it. So after the filtration system, which is, I guess, that one path there is what we need to take. And then there's another area that we can save in. Again, I don't have enough food to do that. I don't have enough food to do that. So we go down here into this thing. What the fuck? And then in the depths, I don't even know what happens in the depths. I don't even think that's where we need to go. I'm going to be honest with you. I don't know if that's where we need to go or not. What I do know is that I need to basically somehow get up again, climb up, then over, then I need to get into it. I don't even know how to do that. And then that's where it takes you here. And then you have to find a way. Oh my god. You have to find a way through this maze. Again. To. I think that's the right path. The path to get out of the, dr the filtration system is stupid. <laughs> what the fuck? And there's this long path here, which takes you. I don't even know where you're supposed to go. I guess you need to go to shoreline? I don't. What the fuck? Why is this map? This This is a terrible map design okay that's where i was so don't i don't need to worry about that unless no drainage system is not where rain world map oh my god okay is the depths where you need to go or does it not matter How do you even beat this game? What's the... What is the goal?
so it's kind of an open world game and you need to find your family. So where we're going is towards a family member, but still even then if I were to even do that, I'd have to make my way back up again to then go to another entire section that I haven't even gone to yet. Oh my god, no wonder why I fucking no wonder no wonder why, like, 8% of people have beaten this game. What the fuck? The hunter. The survivor. The land has become your home. What the fuck? This is probably the one of the more harder games that you'd have to play to get like a hundred percent oh my god wow well now that i've gotten that now that i understand how the game works i guess i could i guess i could watch videos of it now what is germa doing what is he playing what is he doing? Before it gives me an ad. I've been streaming for seven hours. I, okay, that's just not going to let me watch it. There's a video i was kind of interested in watching and then i didn't watch it because it says the most complex ecosy ecosystem in any game i didn't watch it because i didn't want to get spoiled by this game and now that i've pretty much seen a lot of it or a, a, an okay amount of it 3.9 hours of it i guess um almost four hours of it uh i guess uh fuck I don't know. I don't even know if I want to go out of my way to beat it. I don't think I'm going to beat it on stream. I don't even know if I want to go out of my way to beat it on my own, to be honest. I don't know. Like, is it really worth my time? Like, whenever you... I just, I want to see the cool shit. Right, I want to see all these animals and stuff, and these these um like the the monsters that are living in these. Uh, the problem is definitely in its difficulty and gatekeeping. Um, sadly, because I want to, the danger should be from the animals, not from the platforming, or the the game like the game design is kind of shitty when it comes to the map um i don't i don't know man there's just it looks like there's a lot here in their little trailer they show like all these cool little insects and shit and it's just like i want to see that Enjoyable to play, but with. Let me see. This was made today by Cool Nauto. Cool Nauto. I've spent an hour straight dealing with unresponsive swimming controls and random leeches pulling me down for nearly unreactable instant death while aimlessly wandering around. Um, an area with basically no landmarks on top of the most inconsistent guidance system I've seen in years. There is a lot of fun concepts, and the procedural animation is very smooth and enjoyable to play with, but 
it is beyond frustrating to wander around making what feels like no progress on anything whatsoever just to get caught by some random gotcha one shot from a uh from around the corner is there something more to get wait is there something more to get to in this game or is this just a trial and error rng walking sim that's the most recent one And then here's a different kind of response to it. A slimy rat crawls up the cancer-infested anus of a machine god for instructions on how to commit... Okay. It's basically a pain simulator with a rodent that rejects his family to meet a Discord bot to then bathe in piths... or Sorry, bath in piths. Try not to die until you can die my favorite game of all time probably there's no experience quite like it it's really tough at first but trust me once you get used to it it's not so hard and it feels really rewarding the difficulty creates a feeling of helplessness that is huge part of the world's atmosphere uh you get no upgrades and no items you just get smarter and it's so rewarding but that's not even counting the game world and progression of the game itself. Those are the aspects that make me really love it. The lore isn't just some copied slash reskinned version of what every Metroidvania is doing. There's tons of depth to it, and it's really unique. Every location feels like a real location, and thanks to the way the map is designed, it is not... It is... It's not as easy to just memorize where everything is on your first run. So there's a lot of replayability. Now allow me to sum up Rain World for you and save up um save you from reading these other shitty reviews. Ahem. Rain World is a masochism sim for the whole family where a blob and a ferret somehow did a disgusting inbreeding process which resulted in the player character. You can tell this person's a fan of uh, Moist Critical um, because they're using um, jokes about sex. Uh, and also saying um, uh, edgy words like uh, the, the um, S word, commit S, and uh, slimy rat, and then says anus. Uh, the process which resulted in the player character. Our blob of rodent meat travels many unique worlds, such as Tet, tet Anus, Tet Anus, and more Tet Anus. I, I, I don't even know if I'm saying that how they want you to say it. Finding unique enemies such as a radioactive lizard, Penis Fly, Nusk, uh, looking at thing, fucking cancer, and let's not forget the monkeys. Now, I don't even know if they're a Moist Critical fan or if they're just, I don't even know, I, like, 16 years old, penis fly. I, I didn't even see that when I was looking at it. <laughs> our white spray painted jalapeno looking guy will find new friends along the way such as why all caps why did the blue thing die when i ate the white things and blue thing 2.0 they really like to say this word cancer edition uh and last but not least depressed ghost Turns out, we later learn that the entire story is basically just that some made, yeah, monks made robots, then died. Yup, 
Just what I expected. Welp, the rodent has nothing else to do but to do the thing all rodents do at some point and jump into a KFC deep fryer. Except this one has a supernatural worm god like KFC deep fryer. Like most KFC deep fryers. This guy's so fucking funny. After this ordeal happens, when you go outside and ask yourself, what the F star CK did I just witness? Because I think Steam censors certain words, unless he did that himself, so Steam doesn't censor it themselves. Yeah, Steam, uh, Steam does like the black bar thing, so yeah, they just, censor, they just censored it themselves, so you could see exactly which cuss word they were saying. And that's basically the Rain World experience. In closing, this game is a masterpiece that leaves a mark on you and the feeling of wanting more. And if you must take anything with you after finishing this fantastic game, let it be uh, let it be to always remember when life gets rough and you're feeling lost or lonely. You just gotta become a strong, independent, brave, sentient batch of rodent slime. 139 people found this review helpful and 50 people found this review funny we also got some words here poetry which is 12 take my points which is three cloning unicorn and then 13 other ones let me see the uh i want to see what other people say i don't know how to express to you how much joy this review brought to me and I will not now be purchasing the game so that I too may experience the thrill of being a jalapeno popper blob ferret that won the Russian roulette of obscure KFC gods and now gets to convene with the mighty supernatural soup. I love this review so much. This review is a real roller coaster. I love it. Well, I guess if other people like it, I just kind of found the the writing a little bit cringe but everybody's you know uh humor is subjective so personally i didn't necessarily find it funny i just found it a little they're trying too hard kind of thing but that's okay if if people like that then i guess people like it you gotta find the audience and you know if if people screaming into their microphone is what is interesting to people and people find entertaining then uh yeah nature is wrong dangerous yeah so fantastic game about equal in its space extremely well thought out uh deeper lore and ai systems to the point that they would be worthy of an early yeah this is the part that i read among the eight percent of people that ever beat the game after buying it my advice buy the game without a second thought but unless you like you like mind-numbing suffering Get someone with a, yeah, they were telling you to basically have somebody, I see what they mean. They want you to have somebody who's beaten the game be there for you to basically guide you on where to go, um, which makes sense. They spent, it took them about 42.1 hours, I guess, to beat the game, maybe? Assuming that's correct. Drainage system is cringe. Yep, <laughs> it is. <laughs> You are correct. Uh, I hated it. It rains in this world. Good one. Uh, oh boy. Here's a different opinion that is also just as long. Just to see what they exactly are talking about. This is the opposite of what that person said who said that this was... That people who dislike this game is cringe. Or shouldn't. No... This is the mostly focused on why I wouldn't recommend so I can avoid making a novel. I'm sorry, but I'm done with this game. I played Hollow Knight, Blast of the Mist, both Ori games, Dead Cells, etc. You get it. I either played them on normal or hard mode because I really do enjoy a challenging platformer as I grew up with those. Um, For me, I do enjoy a challenge if I really, really enjoy the gameplay loop. If the gameplay loop is very well made and well designed, then I think any kind of challenge to said game is very nice, especially if they offer easier levels for people who 
don't want to have to do with that or are a game journalist or uh, a person who is a Twitch streamer who doesn't want to do anything challenging. They just want to have a little bit of a challenge, but not as much of a challenge to where they can still have fun with it and get through the content of the game, right? That's why I enjoy Isaac. It is technically a harder game, and um, I play on hard. I've I've played on hard since I bought the game again on Steam, and I've only played on hard since then on there on on that account. I've almost never touched a normal. <clears throat> and um, yeah, it's just like. Challenge is good for people who really, really like a game. If a game is has a set challenge, to you know, like its difficulty is set in stone, you can't really change it at first. This is the difficulty that is meant to be played from the very beginning. Nintendo games are known for this. Uh, this game doesn't have a difficulty kind of thing. It is a set difficulty in the game, and it is pretty much set to hard difficulty. There is a the monk, which is what, I guess that's what they want you to actually play um, whenever you're first starting out. If you play as the monk, you can get through this game a lot easier, uh, I assume, because you have less threats. But you still have to deal with the rain, and that's what that's the difficulty sliders for the game. Um, is the monk is the easy, the survivor is the is the main normal difficulty slash hard difficulty. So it makes sense for that. <clears throat> So this game does have a difficulty slider. I didn't realize that the monk is basically game journalist mode. Uh, I either played them on horror. Or, okay, I like the challenge as a platformer. So <clears throat> this game, though, ugh, I I want to love it so bad. Beautiful art style, interesting mechanics and lore. It's everything I love in a good platformer, but it's punishing. Too punishing. There's fun punishing, and then there's depression level punishing. This is a masochist game. This is one of the few games that I've dri that ha that's driven me crazy trying to get through. Here, I'll explain the reason why. RNG. Look, I love a little RNG here and there to mix things up. I don't think... That's bad of that's bad of itself. The problem is that this game will at random with no fault of your own ruin 20 minutes of hellish platforming just for a random creature to fall out of the sky and finish you off in one go. I think that happened to me one time, but it was only me dropping down into the water and there was a little newt creature just hanging out there. And I immediately dropped right into it and it ate me instantly. Um, you can get trapped so easily because of a random creature spawns uh, from a new cycle. It's completely defeating um, when that uh, comes about. Physics. I loved the Flash physics games growing up, and it's fun to see that it implemented in a survival game like this. Uh, but damn, does it da uh, dampen the experience here. The weight of falling, creatures pushing you around, and you constantly uh, being given to the mercy of water and anti-gravity in some levels. It all makes uh, makes you feel so helpless to the, uh, to the elements of the game. I know that's what they're going for but it's too too much when you're randomly being thrown about and fighting the physics engine it's exhausting to play i think i understand the water portion um as your character is um losing air this is how how it works so the um so the slug cat is light it will instantly it will start floating up into the uh water naturally on purpose that's how it's designed because it's a light character it's um it just does that naturally as the newt or the slug cat is starts to lose air it immediately starts changing the gravity to where it's immediately wanting to go up and that's why that happens is you basically need to make position your character pretty low down if you're going to have to go pretty far because it's going to immediately start fighting you once it starts wiggling and because it's um the slug cat's losing air 
that's where a lot of people are are getting issues with the swimming controls. Um, I saw the wiggling thing that they mentioned in the thing. Not necessary whatsoever. If in fact it makes it more confusing, you just need to hold in the direction that you need to go. Um, it is a lot harder to control them once you're going in a direction. You also need to the the part where they mention RNG. I completely agree with with the leeches in that water section when you get stuck to a point where you have to go through there. If you saw me playing through, there was just times where there's like five or ten leeches in that one little area with the circles that I had to jump on. There's like the poles that I grab on, jump onto one, grab the other pole, jump on, and then go left into that one area. There's that little bit of water there. There's the leeches there. And sometimes there's just no leeches there. And then um, there's that one area where you have to swim through. And now there's a couple leeches there. And the problem with the leeches is they are designed to drag you down and make it harder for you to swim. So if there's two leeches, um, you're going to have a very hard time because once they know where you are, they're going to harass you the entire time. And that's the, the leeches for me are very frustrating to deal with. That's where the RNG comes in that is very frustrating to deal with. Uh, especially in that drainage system that is very annoying. I think the gatekeeping of having to farm to get, I, apparently it's called karma, karma up to where you can progress is very annoying. Like I said before, you want to have a feeling of progression with, you know, you don't, you don't want to have to look online and figure out what the fuck's going on like I had to. Um, because that's that's not exactly a good thing. It makes sense for you as a game developer at the time, but it definitely makes it harder for the player. Uh, physics, okay, so... <clears throat> level design. Beautiful atmosphere, really. I love the feel of the world, but God, these areas are are long. You have to navigate forever just to get from one area to the next. No fast travels except for a tiny handful granted by achievements. But even then, it's not explicitly obvious uh, you can use them. And the map has has to load forever every time uh, you want to look at it. It does take a while to even look at the map. Like, I get making it an important objective hard to achieve, but when I have to sit through hours of gameplay just to reach said point and then walk all the way back, it makes me not want to finish the game. <clears throat> Edit. Also, uh, to note, the game is a maze, a lack of real direction, and dead ends in such a big world is much too, uh, much too much. Makes sense in other platformers, or, yeah, platforms, um, when you're searching for upgrades and items, but not here, it can be really easy to also um, mistake foreground for walkable space, and then bars used for climbing are very finicky. Progression. There's very little, uh, there's a very loose idea of where to go and what to do, um, but it's so loose, and there's so little expo uh, exposition in between, it can get pretty boring. The annoying part is with a game that seems like it would take a long time to complete. You would have more rewarding gameplay to keep you going. There's nothing. No upgrades, no better weapons, just the base slug cat. Um, you can find interesting items here and there um, that are fun to play with, but they are also so, uh, but they are so, so sparse out. Uh, sp Sparsed out, you hardly um, have a chance to use them. You can also only hold two, uh, two at a time, plus a small item to store. So that's what that is. I thought it would just explode your stomach if you kept it in there for too long. Overall, not a rewarding experience. Edit. Progression is very game knowledge based from my experience, which can be rewarding when you learn better techniques on dealing with situations. The time it takes to get there, though, is very long and frustrating. I know there are a lot of diehard fans. I can see where that comes from, but I just don't um, see the long-term uh, appeal. Last edit, after a few more hours pushing through some 
some last areas. I don't think I'll be changing my opinion anytime soon. It's a beautiful game with a lot of incredible things going for it. But if I was recommend, uh, if I was to recommend this uh, to anyone, I just couldn't. Um, it's a frustrating experience. I can see that um, with how rare just story, um, how rare just story achievements are achieved by others. I can assume I'm not alone on that front. I literally haven't even locked a single achievement, and I guess the way you unlock them is from finding the family. Uh, my god. I got uh, seven cards, though. That's pretty cool, the seven there. It's called a salamander. Is that what they call them? Daddy Long Legs? I haven't even seen that. The upper area was so fucking cool. And then I went into the drainage system. <laughs> it was really, really cool to see, like, look at all these weird, like, above-ground creatures. They're, like, all different. It was, like, throwing all this stuff at you at once. And it was just really, really cool. And then I, as I, I started going down into the drainage system, there's no fast travel system, by the way, which is very annoying because what if I want to take a break and go explore a different area of the map? I'd have to manually go all the way through it just to get back to an area that's more interesting. Because the areas that I'm in now, I'm getting less and less of actual like new creatures. As of right now, I'm dealing with those little crocodile things, salamanders, and I guess sometimes new creatures. But... Yeah, I'm missing out on all the cooler like creatures that are in the game because I I I just don't they're not in there. So I I guess I chose the wrong path for that reason. Like I I don't know. I'm stuck I'm kind of stuck going down that way until I I guess hopefully the family member is down there somewhere. Whatever the you know, whatever's going on there, I don't know. Um drops you in yeah this is the video they're talking about animation and ai the outskirts the industrial waste drainage system garbage waste is that what you call it shoreline scavengers uh shaded citadel never seen those five pebbles the wall then see that farm arrays void sea beyond the light there's a lot of content in these and they don't even mention the Whatever I was in, I don't even remember the name of it. So I guess there's really no... There's that one creature that's like lights up and stuff, but man. I think it just depends on which way you go really determines on if you're going to enjoy uh, the game. So yeah, no, my thoughts uh, again are... I, you, if you're jumping into it like I did, just straight off the bat, uh, you are missing a lot of information because the game doesn't provide any of that for you on purpose. You are supposed to die, and that is what you have to do. You're not given knowledge on purpose of anything that you are doing. I guess the idea... I'm going to assume the idea is that it was supposed to create a community of people who can then start talking about and theorizing what do I need to do to do what and to see how the world interacts. This game is trying to be a survival game, a platforming game, a, a sandbox, um, and a simulation it's trying to be four different genres and it's it's fighting each other every every way possible um it's fighting it's fighting it and uh it, it causes conflicts with a couple of them i definitely think the door system is annoying it's not it's not a good one i think they should have just kept that you don't need a karma system so what I would remove is the karma system and the doors. 
Those are completely pointless, no reason to have them whatsoever. They are only there to exist to add a reason for the food system to exist. That is it. Um, the hibernation thing is fine. Uh, I think you could easily have the food system and the hibernation system and nothing would change. You just get rid of the, the door system where you have to have the, get rid of the karma and get rid of the door system where you can go through the doors to transition to new areas. That's fine. Um, <clears throat> it, it, it's just tacked on there for no reason to gatekeep the game to add more playtime to it that is unnecessary. Uh, the game is already long and it's a maze. You, you already designed this maze game. Uh, so, yeah, it's not necessary. Uh, the, there needs to be more, if we're talking about the sandbox, there needs to be more stuff to play with, uh, more interaction with the world, so you can just kind of, like, play around with these, like, all these monsters and ecosystems is pretty neat. It feels kind of baseline, at least, and once you get to the drainage, like, if you're in, like, the drainage and more down, uh, you're dealing with less interesting enemies as the up area, you know, the, the surface area, the outskirts, there was so much going on, and it really showed off what the game had to offer when it came to the simulation of this ecosystem. There was a that's what was cool about that. It was showing that all these uh, monsters are pretty much hostile towards each other other than themselves. And um you are just part of that as well. Uh and that's just how it's going to be. So that's cool. I wish there was more of that. Uh the platforming isn't necessarily the the part that I exactly like i think the water like you know like the swimming thing is very pretty but yeah it is definitely something that um is a little concerning because so many people have an issue with it a lot of these people aren't playing with a joystick where the game seems to be intended for playing on a joystick at times uh I definitely think it is a little weird that the crouch feature is a toggle instead of just a holding down kind of thing. That's a little weird. Uh, another thing that's weird is apparently you holding A or tapping A or anything um, causes you to uh, lose oxygen faster when underwater. That's a little weird. Um... animation obviously you know like any of the praises that these people are giving it makes you know like the the normal stuff whenever there's a negative review it makes sense i agree um i kind of wish there was a way for you to utilize the um just throwing things more you know, I just wish there was a more more utilization for throwing things and using your weapon instead of just hitting a button and it, you just only throw it left or only throw it right. There needed to be more control with that. You could easily have done that with the mouse or the joystick. You could have easily done that and made it so whenever you're throwing your spear, you can not only stab things, but you can throw it. That would have been nice, um, but they didn't do that for some reason. They could have done that. I don't know why they didn't. Uh, the definitely the control system is a little bit off because again they don't use a lot of they don't utilize a lot of buttons they could have done. Uh, I don't necessarily know why. Um, Maybe it, after they're done with this DLC, maybe they'll actually make Rain World 2 and 
I'd hope that if they do do a Rain World 2, that the movement system is refined, the world is refined and um, worked on and developed more. Um, I would just want uh, the world, you know, like the actual world design is better, you know, more makes sense and less maze-like. That would be really nice. Um, you know, basically kind of like Risk of Rain did when they went to Risk of Rain 2. Um, you know, again, like, I'm conflicted because, obviously, I, if I didn't like it, I wouldn't have played almost four hours of it. Um, I do like it, uh, certain aspects of it. There's, there's, there's parts that I really like. And you can you know which parts I don't like. I shouldn't have to repeat it, but I'll do it one more time. The parts that I don't like, the gatekeeping, the karma system, I don't like those. Um, a little bit more forgiving on the leeches. Uh, it is very annoying uh, that I had to walk all the way back to an area but getting back to the area that I needed to get to to farm for karma again was very difficult and very frustrating to do and they designed that I guess on purpose they they purposefully make you think that you're soft locked because they make it so difficult like the the difficulty spike goes from a 7 to like a 10 um which is very annoying because you then have to kind of i, I understand they want to teach you the the rain like the actual swimming mechanics better and they're doing it in a kind of annoying way rather than naturally introducing you to mechanics like they kind of did at the beginning section um i think it was really fun learning you know, what everything, like, all these monsters were. Learning kind of, like, what I can eat and what I can't eat was pretty fun to do. Um, I just wish I had more control over my character. Uh, a lot more control than what I was given. It felt limited um, after a while. Uh, I do kind of like the platform, like, the climbing system. That's a little fun. I do find it a little bit annoying um, that I had to basically hold up or hit up at the right time after jumping to try to grab like a pole or something i feel like they could have implemented that better by using a grab system rather than using up on the analog stick or um keyboard they could have done something similar to um similar to like uh <clears throat> either either uh you know, kind of like how they did with, um, what was it called? The fucking dead, um, something, day, deadlight? Is that what it's called? The, the one where you have parkouring and there's zombies. I just forgot the name of it. Um, hold on. Kitty. Dying Light. That's the name of it. Dying Light. Yeah, Dying Light. There, and I guess you could even say uh, Assassin's Creed did a really good job when it came to their platforming, I guess you could say. Um, Little Big Planet, kind of. I just feel like uh, having to jump while holding right and then slightly up, and then your character starts immediately climbing the pole because you're holding up can cause issues and also is a little annoying especially in that one area where you need to hold down you have to drop down by pressing down on the analog stick or keyboard and then they want you to immediately hit up 
to grab onto the poles in the background so you don't immediately jump into a pit of leeches and then it becomes very 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 frustrating really quickly to get out of there because your character sometimes decides that they'll actually get up enough on the wall for you to wall jump on and then you have to get high enough on the wall to where whenever you wall jump you actually jump high enough to grab the thing they need to make that a lot better i don't know if you can do that with the pick up grab button i don't know if that's the the x button or i guess whatever it is on the keyboard i don't know if that works with i don't know if that works with pipes or not if it does, then my entire argument makes makes absolutely no sense. As far as I'm aware, hitting up on the thing is the only way for you to basically grab poles and stuff like that. So you can have two different grab buttons, obviously, or you can make it um, the same button, you know. Uh, I'd have to go back in and then find a pole to even figure that out. I'm not going to do that, so... I'm either wrong or I'm right. I'm either right and my entire argument is valid and it makes sense, or I'm wrong and it makes absolutely no sense and it's invalid. Uh, but <clears throat> I'm just going to go on the assumption that I am correct. Uh, and... What else? Mazes don't stop. You're you're having a maze, right? But then you're adding on to the maze by adding a time limit to where now you are basically being forced to rush through a maze that can basically um, be complete dead ends everywhere you can possibly go, forcing you to then have to go back to grinding to go through the gate again and then attempt again if you did everything right then you'd get two attempts uh to then go through the maze again and if you fuck that up and you spend too much time in there or you get killed then you're done you're done son you got to do it all over again you got to go back farm some more come back uh fuck up twice and then go back and then it's just a dumbass system because you only get so many attempts to try to get through an area and you have there's no food there too foods become extremely scarce in that area there i saw zero like easy food to eat to then save which for some reason the game gives you the game gives you two save spots in that area uh, in close succession on purpose just to fuck with you uh, when there's literally no food. Uh, so it's just it's just to mock you. Mock you for getting that far and then not having any uh, any way of eating anything because there's no food for you'd have to go through that entire water section again. Then climb up uh and then eat and then save it a different one yeah you, you, there's literally you're kind of in a messed up area you have to either pull up the maze solution which it seems there is no good map that i can find at all uh online so far unless i look hard enough because it's all zoomed out and not helpful uh you you at least you would more pain you have to pull up a walkthrough of sorts and at least for the filtration system uh it took me a while in the drainage for me to even find where to go and it was just kind of like trial and error pretty much just that was annoying yeah <clears throat> I just think there's a lot going for it and then there's a lot going against it and uh it's classic indie game 2017 no I wouldn't say 2017 is classic but it's a classic indie game issue where 
surprisingly, the devs of a game manage to make a more annoying thing. And apparently, Downpour is adding more to it. I don't know how much they're adding, but what I do know, there's actually four QA testers for Downpour specifically, which I guess wasn't developed by the original team. So maybe the uh, the people, the team of Downpour, I'm hoping that they uh, did a good job and liked the game enough to where they actually made it function better. Let me see. I'm going to watch a trailer for it. That's loud. A new world awaits. Ew. As the downpour arrives, a rebirth blossoms and thrives. New creatures, both predators and prey. Each one bearing new gifts and exploring unfamiliar lands. To survive alone is foolish. A pack has its place at the top of the food chain. So they add co-op? Or something. This ruined landscape. This fearless monstrosities and undiscovered mysteries provide the slow path for the journeys. You can bear January 19th so it's actually coming out in a couple days oh geez well hey slug cats I'm buddy the community manager for Akupara games and today I'd like to introduce you to the five new playable slug cats coming in rain world downpour our new expansion for rain world coming soon if you haven't heard about the downpour expansion for rain world it's bringing a whole host of new changes characters enemies areas and more to the rain world experience but the thing i really want to dig into today are those five adorable new slug cats they are the rivulet the spear master the saint the gourmand and the artificer up first let's talk about the rivulet this blue little guy has a ton of advantages to living in the harsh, foreboding environment of Rain World. It runs faster, jumps higher, and can breathe underwater. Oh no, it's showing, it's showing gameplay of the drainage. It can zip across the map uh. rainstorms. That's the good news. The bad news is, one, all that running and swimming burns a ton of calories. Two, what? hibernation cycles are shorter than any other slug cat. And three, it doesn't carry much food over from day to day. Play the rivulet if you want to be agile, but don't mind stocking up between storms. If you're looking for a little more aggression, though, maybe the spear master will be for you. This spiky slug cat spawns spears, which is a tongue twister that I nailed on the first try. This is my first take, definitely not my fifth one, out of its tail, which means that any time you can start stabbing spiders, scavengers, or squid cada. The spear master drains one food for every spear it lands on a target, which means it isn't all that interested in the dangle fruits and slime mold that other slug cats will need to sustain themselves. If you want to survive as spear master, you better be out for blood. Play the spear master if you want to be the predator, hunting down prey and aggressively thriving between. Uh, okay. But maybe you want the opposite of that aggressive playstyle. Well, the saint much prefers to avoid confrontations at all costs, which even okay. includes using its long tongue to grapple through areas of the world. If the rivulet is nimble in water, the saint is acrobatic in the air, and you need to use that aerial finesse to stay high above the danger. The saint won't even touch a spear, which can leave it a little bit exposed to being hunted down and devoured. Play the saint if you want to deftly dodge your doom hmm. or acrobatic antics. The gourmand, by the way, can we all just appreciate the size? Look, look at this. 
No. Well, I will say there's a lot about this game that I just kind of hope that, like, I wish it was not a platforming game. I wish it was just a pure survival Terraria game, kind of, with actual, like, prey. Or, like, I guess Ark? I've never even played Ark, but I guess Ark would be a better example. It just feels like it wants to be all of that. I just wish it was just a survival game with this really nice, like, fluid control and de- being the prey, right? You know, um, not having this whole idea where you basically go through platforming areas and stuff like that. That's not, it's not the fun part. For I do like the platforming, climbing up ropes and climbing up vines. All that stuff is good. I'm talking about. I'm talking about the part where you need to jump through things, you need to go through areas, and it's like it, it's trying to be linear on top of being open world, and it's annoying to get around um, certain places or stuff. Uh, I, it's just like, man, I don't know. I don't know if Downpour is just basically going to be, you're playing the in- entire game, campaign or if it's just adding on top of the entire campaign meaning that there's even more areas i thought going into this that it was going to be apparently there is split screen co-op and split screen pvp or shared i don't even know how that works remote play on tv and remote play together remote play sucks ass so anyways um oh man I I don't know. I I know there's a lot of people out there that really really enjoy just this kind of thing where it's just um dying and um just being forced to have to backtrack because you can't go through a door and then getting frustrated because you have to go through, you have to backtrack and it's even more annoying to backtrack in the game and it punishes you for having to backtrack every step of the way. It really does, you know, tell you to turn back every step of the way. I just wanted this. I just really, I really, I really, really, really like all the other stuff except for the main aspect of what the game wants you to do on top of that. Um. So with all that in mind, it's going to be really, really hard for me to want to jump back into it and even go anywhere near wanting to beat it. I'm definitely not doing another stream of this. Uh, there's no reason to. Uh, I've, you've you've gotten pretty much the concept of it, the entire idea of it. Apparently, we're finding our family. Apparently, so I guess whenever you meet a dead end, I'd hope that that's where a family member is. I really do think that idea that I had earlier with the idea where you uh can evolve your slug cat. And to any other playstyle, you know, any playstyle, instead of doing this character system where they're trying to be like a roguelike on top of this game. Um, another annoying thing is the transition between rooms. If it's a bigger room, they need to fix that bad. The The snapping of it is very, very annoying. And it's hard for me to fit like whenever it happens, it takes me a second to even find where I am again because I don't know where I am. That's really, really bad. It needs to be a smooth transition. I don't know if there's a mod for that. Um, let me see. Rain DB. That's what they call it. <laughs> Rain DB. Okay. Expedition challenge game mode. Okay. Jolly co op fixes. Earth world drought. Old new horizons. Acid, arid bar- barrens, drowned pantheon, 
Aether Ridge, the Mast, the Route 2.0, Coral Caves Undersea. So these are just newer areas, I guess. I don't want newer areas. I want um I want specifically uh patches and things that make the game less annoying. I don't care about challenges. Adds a new quest line starting at five pebbles. It unlocks the ability to read per pearls remotely and, and read no. Acid Barrens is uh, a wasteland, so just adding more, you know, I guess areas. Again, whenever they they, whenever I was reading this, I got the impression that it was different. You know, like every every playthrough is going to be different. Um, it says here: explore a vast world of over one thousand six hundred rooms, spanning twelve diverse regions filled with ancient secrets and undiscovered dangers whenever i read this part right here and i saw 1600 rooms i was thinking oh so that means it's gonna be like isaac where it's uh where it's procedurally generated and so every game it's gonna be a little bit different right but no um whenever i read movements and uh, nimble movements and procedurally generated animation um, I was thinking that it was also going to be procedurally generating uh, your world so that every playthrough is different, but it's not. I was hoping that was. Replaces all the shelter rooms in the original game to make the shelters more unique and interesting in their designs. Drainage system plus a region expansion which adds over 100 new screens to drainage system. Five new music tracks. Why would you want to do that? Here you go. Many, many more fixes. This looks like something that's actually a large batch of bug fixes. Quality of life features and performance enhances added to the game. Ported early from the upcoming more slug cats mod. I don't care about the more slug cats. I just want more fixes. Read me. Yeah, just read me. I, I want to read it. I don't want to. Freaking bitch. I just wanted, I just wanted, I, I was hoping there was a page so I could actually read more. <sighs> Whatever. I wanted to know exactly what they meant by what bug fixes they were making and quality of life features they were adding. Because that would help. But I guess I can't do that because Google is dumb. So here's new cats because, you know. Modifies the thing, custom tails. Allows a custom texture, color, and gradient to be applied to slug cat tails. Lizard customizer. Color foot. Twitch integration connects Rain World to the Twitch API, allowing channel point redemptions to affect the streamer's game. That's kind of cool. SB's camera scroll. Creates a smooth, uh, scroll a smooth scrolling camera. Oh my god, that moves with the subcat. Thank fucking god. That is actually the mod that I was looking for. Exactly what I was looking for. So yeah, I'd be downloading this. I don't know how I'd add it to the game. Requires config machine to be installed. And hook mod. I don't even know what that is. But this is the exact mod that I would be looking for right here. Blood mod. <laughs> mod that adds new blood effects to the game, making combat and creature interactions more um, visceral. <laughs> Dungeon world. Randomly mixes around the pipe destinations in every region, making the world unpredictable to navigate and never changing. That's more what I thought the game was going to be like. That's cool that that's a thing. Enemy randomizer. Randomizes the creatures that spawn from all dens in the game, meaning any creature can spawn anywhere. I don't know how I feel about that. I do like how the game's designed around that whole idea where it's like, um, where it's like, okay, so this is where these monsters live. This, it makes sense for them to live here. What is this? Beastmaster allows you to spawn a variety of creatures. No. 
All randomly generated values in the game will now have fixed values. Wow. I don't know how I feel about that. Um, but yeah, no, that, that smooth scrolling one is so nice. That definitely helps. Input fix. Fixes the game's controller handling, adds rumble support, and other minor improvements like trigger button binding. That's actually helpful. That's a good one. Pause settings. That would also help too. Forecast, a dynamic and configurable weather mod that adds new rain, snow, and light lightning effects. I don't know how I feel about that. Tidal rotation mood mod. Day and night cycle effect to all three to all areas in Rain World. Line of sight. Limits the player's field of view based on the surrounding terrain. Eh. I just wish there was more pictures and just more that they could add to these because it would be nice for me to be able to see more. Electric spear. Crafting. Um, I don't know about that. Simplified moveset. Simplified jumps. Aim anywhere. That's helpful. Omni throw. Gives the slug cat the ability to throw objects in any direction. That's... Exactly what I was talking about. Yes, aim anywhere. Gives the slug cat the ability to throw objects in the direction of the mouse cursor. Uh, keep that away from me. Mod that lets you ban types of creatures or items. Hunter spawn, bash ability. I'm good on that one, super slug. Yeah, it looks like better behaved beasts improves the reindeer behavior. Allows you to wiggle in their horns to make them turn around. Also allows modders to use mod uh, myro birds and deer in any room they assign them to. Okay. Score tracker. Death count. Thanks for that. Cycle config. Unlimited passage mod. Allows the gamers a fast travel feature. Passage to be used in an unlimited number of times. Well, I didn't have that before, so no. Changes how you... Uh, how you play the game by giving death serious consequences. That's a little nice, but... Okay. I don't know how much what they mean by that, so that's... I don't know. Breakable spears? No. Dislodge spears. That's another good one. Adds a custom button that allows you to dislodge spears that are stuck in the terrain. That's <clears throat> after you throw it. That's very nice. It doesn't say after you throw it, but that would be. That's what I assume they mean. Damage config. Don't grab bats. I don't know why you'd want to do that. Uh, because I do want to grab the bats because I want to eat them. <laughs> and I think you only grab them when you're hungry and you need it. That's the only reason they do that. Peaceful world. Modifies the behavior of most of the creatures that make them more peaceful. Okay. Worm repellent. Friendly plant life. Anti-worm grass. No. Social distancy. I think the ones that I found here are very, very... Are the ones that basically... Exa you know, there are a couple things that are helpful with that. Um... If there's a mod to remove the stupid door in Karma feature, then perfect, right? <laughs> That's all that needs to be changed, and then I basically have the better version of the game that I wanted to play. Or I thought I, the dungeon thing, like, the game is already designed around not being a dungeon-like thing, and the only reason you'd want to get that is after you've played the game enough times to where you're like, okay, I've beaten the game. Now I can just have RNG everything, right? With all these other systems. Uh, what was this one? I saw, like, green. Charge cat. The ability to shoot energy projectiles. <laughs> no. <laughs> to four players, you know. So, camera scrolls are very good. The um, Rain World... Uh, input fix, which is nice. So this is a mod that replaces. Uh, should work better with Steam input. This means controller handling won't be broken when playing over things like Steam Remote Play. 
optional controller rumble support trigger uh triggers are treated as buttons so you can bind them show better button names in the options menu can fully be toggled with uh, checkbox settings so that's nice that's helpful i need to apparently turn on enable steam input for this which i didn't even know exists uh, omni throw it would be nice and uh, dislodge spears so camera scroll input fix or omni throw and dislodge spears these are mods that seem like they're very good and would improve on the game uh but my god there's a lot of mods that adds more rooms and more characters um which is just not my thing uh, at the moment at least unless i wanted more uh more all right all right i'm gonna stop now um yeah, I said what I needed to say, so have good morning, good day, good afternoon, good night. Um, yeah, maybe see you tomorrow. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, bye. Hopefully this was interesting. I don't know. I think I think what I said was range true. I think it's like, yeah, it makes sense. Um, the question is, I don't know if I'll ever finish it. I don't know if I will. It definitely won't be a stream thing. I think what I did was enough for stream. And, um, yeah, uh, take that with what we, what you will, uh, maybe you, you, th saw the gameplay and you're like this is perfect this is exactly exactly what i want but keep in mind that i never finished dark souls remastered uh, i got tired after fighting the woman who is a giant spider in a web room and got frustrated um, that i had to go through a poison lake every single time to get to them uh, that took most of your health away on top of that, dealing with enemies that were throwing boulders at you. And I thought, I hate having to run all the way to this boss and barely having any health because uh, the f literal floor, the floor is literally lava and it's really, really annoying to get through. Um, so keep that in mind um, when I say that I'm not nec I'm a person who likes a challenge if I'm enjoying the gameplay. And Dark Souls does not have a gameplay that I enjoyed, at least the remastered one. I don't know if Dark Souls 2 or Dark Souls 3 are even worth it, and I don't even know if Elden Ring is even worth it, considering the gameplay of Elden Ring is literally the gameplay of Dark Souls 3, Dark Souls 2, and Dark Souls 1. It's all the same fucking game, and also don't forget about fucking bloodborne which is literally the same fucking game except with a different um style of the game it's all the fucking same secure it's all the same it's all the same fucking game it's all the same fucking game when will you guys realize this it's like it's like the people are like if you don't have anything that's saying don't say anything at all if you um if uh you don't like the gameplay right it's the gameplay, dude. If you don't like the gameplay, then you don't like the game. You know what I'm saying? I like the gameplay loop, and I like to play it over and over again. I like to play the same exact game, but it has more shit, and it's more harder than the last one, and it's funny. Haha. <laughs> I love hard bosses. I love hurting myself, dude. I love stabbing myself, dude. I love it. 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 Um... I don't Rain World just oh my god it's a love hate relationship it has a lot going for it and then there's just a lot going against it that I just hate and yeah if I ever actually get around to playing more of it I doubt I will it's it's either I 
beat the game in one sitting, uh, just like I did with Super Meat Boy. Um, or that's it. It's a one. It's a game that I play for a long period of time, one time, and then I never touch it again uh, because it's just not worth it. Luckily for me, I was able to beat Super Meat Boy in one sitting. Um, I I went out of my way to beat the entire thing, not just skipping all the extra stuff. Just go straight through it. Um, the other game, what was it? The the second Super Meat Boy game that I played, I forgot the name of. At the end is nigh. Um, is basically just a Metroidvania Super Meat Boy, I guess. So Rain World, but less interesting. <laughs> um. That was okay, but I thought, yeah, if I didn't beat it on this one play, you know, stream, I'm not gonna beat the game. You know, I'm not gonna go back to it or ever play it because it's just it's not fun, really. I'm not really a huge, massive fan of platformers to begin with. Just like how I'm not a fan of Mario. Like I played Mario Odyssey for a little bit, and I thought, well, this is all right. And then I thought, wait, uh, they just want you to do the same thing for about ten hours. And then I remember that's exactly what people want sometimes. And I know that's what Isaac can be technically. You are basically doing the same thing for 5,000 hours. But uh, the difference is that uh, Isaac is fun because it's somewhat different every time. It's, it's, a, it's different every time you play. To an extent, obviously it's the same items. There's floors that you'll inevitably see that are the exact same that you've seen before. But um, it's not enough times to where you're like, okay, I can, you know, I've seen this, but I, I don't hate it, you know. And on top of that, uh, I'm unlocking a bunch of cool shit every time I'm playing it. <laughs> uh, you can't really say the same for a lot of games. Definitely, I feel like Rain World 2 get rid of the characters, add an actual RPG system to the game that involves you evolving your your slug cat to your liking. Basically making it more unique to you as a player. Uh, so whenever you're going around and doing stuff, your character is evolving and it's evolving to how you to what you specifically want to evolve it to. And it shows the character. It, your char your slug cat does change in its design with every ev evolution you're doing to it. Easily would make the game a lot more fun and worthwhile with the grinding part that they want you to do. It would be worthwhile. But instead of doing that kind of grinding system, that would make more sense and be more fun and it would add on top of the survival aspects that they're adding into the game. Um, it just leaves it shallow. It leaves the survival aspect of the game very shallow and boring. Um, I mean, it's okay. I think being prey and being chased down by a monster that I literally can't kill is kind of fun. Um, and being dealt uh, dealing with the unknown can be fun as well. But yeah, no, there's a lot going against it that I hate that's going against it that I wish, you know, as indie as an indie game, I was hoping that they would not fall victim of AAA companies and what they end up doing. It really is. Um, yeah, so uh, anyways, okay, done, yeah.